Here we go, man. It is good to see ya. Welcome. Welcome, everyone. It's Abdallah here, bringing you guys another awesome live stream for Animal Crossing New Horizons on Nintendo Switch. Today's video is all about testing love and friendship within Animal Crossing. Now, for those of you guys unacquainted with the concept of friendship, well, if you reach a certain amount of friendship points with these animals, they will give you a specialized framed photo that is exclusive to their character. Those are probably one of the rarest items that you can possibly have, and it takes a lot of work. So what today what we're going to be doing is we're going to be testing it out. Now, shoutouts to a whole bunch of uh, scientists in the uh, Animal Crossing Discord. Uh, Ninji, Stony, Astronomy Fort 2, uh, Barandi, Alexis, and uh, of course I was chatting with Oralu as well in the Discord about how this stuff is actually calculated. So it's based on data mined information. But we're going to put it to the test, and then after this, we're going to... Take all of our findings and I'm going to make it into a nice compact video so that you guys can learn from it as well. So you guys don't have to see the, the long and arduous testing part. Now a couple disclaimers is that the number in the bottom corner over there with the Audi and the heart, it's going to be an approximation, okay? So I don't, I don't need any of you guys saying, oh, I'm Abdallah, you know, that's actually 27 when it should be 28. You know, something like that. Don't even worry about it. It's just an approximation so that we can kind of gauge where we're at because there's no on-screen heart counter in the game, unfortunately. So we're going to have to figure that out. Um, other than that, there's a lot that goes into it. So I hope that you guys enjoy the science behind love and it's going to be a great time today. So shout outs to all of you guys that are coming here. Thanks for coming. What's up? What's going on, Ming? Malik? Uh, Michaela? Rage Game? H. Fenton? Good to see you. Audi, out of the way, please. Look at me over in Harv's Island. Wow, look at me actually using Harv's Island. Oh, man. Giovanni, Jay McLean, hey, good to see you. Good to see you. Amazing Penguin, hi. Uh, Robert, what's going on? Uh, Tospi, 2Spy, good to see you. Little Carrot, hi, 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 hello. Holy Angel, what's going on? Romy, hi. Griffin Dork, Jen Smith, Autogirl. Angie, Cell Dweller, hi. How are you guys? Okay, so I'm out here in Harv's Island. I had to do it. Uh, you know, you know what I found out. I've been watching a, a lot of Westworld lately, and Harv's Island is actually Westworld confirmed. Just throwing it out there. Okay, so one of the finer data points of friendship is that every single one of your villagers starts at 25 friendship points. We're gonna be trying to go to maybe max 255. I don't know. I kind of want to keep on going just to see what will happen once you hit max friendship with someone. So 25 is right here. I think that during this live stream, we're going to be uh, traveling through at least 30 different days in order to get all this fun stuff. So let's do it. I, I think I'm absolutely ready for it. So thanks for coming. And then of course, we're going to be testing all sorts of theories along the way. Hey, there we go. There's our target. Okay, okay, okay. I'm not ready yet. I'm not ready yet. I got to give her something or at least talk to her. So... How are you guys doing today? Uh, today is Monday, a brand new week, and I told you guys earlier that we are absolutely going to be uh, working on science throughout the week versus visiting all of your, oh, 82,000. That's a lot of money, Audi. Wow. Uh, Krista, Marie, hey, welcome. Thank you so much. I need something that's uh, 10K. Audi, you're going to make me broke, girl. Dang, yo, it's just like real life. Lawnmower, no way, man. All right, well... I need money. <laughs> if you're gonna need, m if you're gonna want to make these friends, yo, getting that big money is probably the best bet. What's up, Tink Tink? Ah, uh -huh, good to see you. Thanks so much. I need to fill my pockets full of bells, and we just gotta spend this money on this girl right now in order to win her affection, just like real life. Just kidding. Ha, huh? that's not how love works. No, you can one does not simply buy love. <sighs> Anyway, I'm already on thin ice with that comment. All right, let's uh, not talk about that. Let's get some, let's fill up our uh, our monies. I'll do like a million bells. Don't look at my account. <laughs> Good. Chris, Chris does like little pop-up actually just like covered up my bell amount. Don't look at my bells. It's private information. What are you, that person in the, the bank? 
in the teller line when you go to make a deposit that's like a little bit too close you're like looking over their shoulder to see how much money they have get out of here with that anyway so one of the things uh that we're gonna do i'm like eighty two thousand for that audi you're so expensive i don't know if that's gonna be something that i'll get her though but we'll see we'll absolutely see i'm like looking to try to buy some oh wow whitney dang dude don't don't look at me whitney I'm currently wooing Audi over here. 82,000. It's expensive taste. All right, so uh, apparently you need to buy something from the shop that is um, 10,000 or more. Hi-Fi stereo is absolutely eight times as much. So is that going to affect how much friendship points you get off of Audi? No, it won't. It's overkill. So that's kind of the thing that I'm just kind of uh, looking at here. So anyway, Audi, where'd you go? Oh, look at you chilling out over here. So whenever you talk to a villager, that's going to be plus one. Uh, that's for the day. Once per day, you're going to get the talking bonus, according to this uh, science. All right. Oh my gosh, I was I the only one seeing that much of you. Now again, remember, I probably talked to Audi a handful of times ever since she moved in. So we're just gonna default to 25 right now. Okay, so there we go. That's me talking to her. All right, talking to her, man. Uh, let's chat. I want to give her something, but I don't think um, I don't think we're at the point of friendship yet, where I can give her stuff. Audi, Audi, Audi! Come on, girl. Let's go. Yeah, I don't, I don't think, I don't think this is going to do anything. Like, I'm, I'm not at a point where I just give her something. And I don't want to bother her either by, like, over-talking to her. I don't want to chat her up, so, um, yeah. Alright, get up, get off of that. No! <laughs> All right, I'm just gonna go to the next day. If she's already sitting down, there's no way I could force her off, so I'm going to the next day. I've already got my one point for the day. Whatever. She's sitting down? Cool. A lot of you guys are having some theories about, hey, she's sitting down, therefore you can't really interact with her, so whatever, no sweat off my back. I got my one point off of her, we're good. Where'd that big 26? Wow, oh man, hold on, hold the phone. <laughs> No. I wanted to push her off the chair to give her something, but she just there. I tried to, like, take the stool out from under her, <laughs> but end up taking something off the chair anyway. Hey, what's going on? Irene, thank you for the uh, upgrade to Fireflower tier. Welcome. What's up? How are you doing today? And Fading Violet to Mushroom tier. Welcome. Oh, man, let's get some hype in the chat. I think we really need an Audi emote, just saying. Okay, here we go, next day. <laughs> you know, like, you should pull out the chair for the ladies when uh, when you come in, you come into a restaurant, right? No, on Animal Crossing, we take the chair out from under you in order to talk to you. It's different here, right? Oh my gosh, so funny. This is going to be a pretty long live stream if I'm not able to get out of the friend zone. <laughs> oh man, wow. Yeah, I'm totally friend zoned with Audi right now. Like, she's not. not doing anything. Alright, Odds, where are you? I gotta find you. Ew, you need to leave. <laughs> Ew, you need to leave. Where are you? Oh my gosh, see that? Oh, yes, beautiful. Thank you. Hi. Number one. Staying trendy, Foxtrot? Uh, yeah, this is for you. Oh, here we go. This is 82,000 bells. So here we go. 82,000 bells is the second one, right? Yeah, here we go. 82,000 bells. Okay, what could it be? I'm gonna sing while I open it. Hi-Fi Stereo? Are you, like, for sure sure I can have this? Yeah. Thanks, Abdallah. I love this color. I'm going to show this off in my house as soon as I figure out where to put it. Hey, I wanted to say thanks, but with, like, an object. It's a ball. Enjoy. Okay, that's really good. Okay, so a lot of science just happened right there. 
I don't know if you can wrap your head around it. All right, so a lot of science just happened there. So let's break it down. Let's break it down. So we got, that was really cool. I think we're regular friends. So since we're regular friends, we got one additional point. Uh, when I gave her, uh, when I gave her the wrapped gift, I'm going to say that that's going to be four points. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so I think we just got, I think we got five points off of that approximately. Based off of the current information that's out there. Because we're currently friends and not good friends, we're gonna get an additional one bonus point. An additional one bonus point for wrapping the present and three bonus points for um, for it being a piece of furniture that's over 10,000 bells. So I'm adding five. 27 plus five, one, two, three, four, five. Yeah, beautiful. It's good. I'm gonna go to the shop and see what they have first and gift wrap it. That was cool. There's a lot of science that happened over there. And again, approximations, man, approximations. That's kind of what we're doing. At the very end of this live stream, I'm going to take all of this data and I'm going to compile it down with the numbers and everything like that so that you guys can replicate this at home. But I need something for 10K and that's a washing machine that's most likely 10K. Holy moly. Dude, 76? No, I like you, but I don't like you that much. I'm gonna get broke soon. Gosh, Audi, why you gotta be so expensive? What is it, sea monkeys? How much? 10k? Oh, dang. Yo, Audi, man, she's got expensive taste. All right, we're about to gift wrap that in gold wrapping paper. Nothing but the best, am I right? What does it mean when they give you a picture, uh, Angie? That means that you've achieved best friend status with them. So that's exactly what we're trying to do here. And that's gonna happen right around 150 points. So we'll see. We'll see exactly how it happens and when it does, it's going to be pretty fun. And then we're going to take the footage, we're going to like dissect it for science and see what's up. Yeah, give me something that's like super, uh, <laughs> give me something that's craftable. That's what we need, like honestly. The best things are going to be craftable. Of course, you don't have to buy things for 70,000 as long as it's over 10K. And if it's a DIY item that you have, as long as it sells for over 2,500, you're gonna be golden for that specific max points and optimization, so. Dun, 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 dun. Okay, keeping on up. Okay, what do we need? Iron garden bench, that's not bad. Iron materials to craft. Knight's helmet for five iron? That's pretty decent, but iron's pretty hard to come by, right? We need some like fruit stuff. 20 peaches for a peach wall? That's a lot of peaches for one three pointer. Like here's what I'm looking for, right? And you guys can help with science too. Find me a DIY recipe with common items that sells, if you were to sell it for, at Nook's, uh, Nook's Cranny, it would sell for over 2,500. 2, That's kind of the uh, little science experiment that we're doing here. Because what happens if you go inside the shop and um, like there's nothing for 10K? Like, do you miss out on those potential points for the day? No, you can technically craft something. But I'm not about to come out here saying, oh yeah, here you go, spend 60 stone on this uh, on this tall garden rock. 60 stone though? You know how many rocks you have to hit for that? No, son. <clears throat> I want something easy. What's a common material, right? What did she say about young bamboo? I don't care about that. What's a common material and a DIY that's really easy to make? Like that's the that's the money answer. And we'll find it. We will find it by the end of the stream. All right, speaking of finding things, let's go get Audi really quick. Oh, look at you. You going? 
I can't. No, sorry. Not right now, man. I'm... I got other things to deal with. Sorry. He's the guy that I want to leave, too. Sorry, buddy. And I don't have my stuff. I don't even know where Audie's house is. I should know where Audie's house is by now. Come on, where are you at, girl? Let's go. I should know where your house is. Yeah, okay. You better be at home. I don't want to go inside nooks looking for you. <laughs> Hey, there you are. Hello there. Hello, lovely. That's a plus one, just talking to her. 33. Uh, this is yours. Actually, you know, I'm just gonna say I'll be seeing you. And then I'm gonna say this is yours. Do you want this? Look, I got a gift wrap present. Here you go. It's, uh, it's a new automatic washer. Oh, what is it? It's a mystery. I'm gonna open it now. Deluxe washer. Are you like for sure sure that I can see whenever they say like there's a there's a, a certain amount of text dialogue that comes up if it's over 10k, I wanna presume. Okay, Loki been wanting something like this for a while. I'm still gonna show it off in your house as soon as I figure out where to put it. I feel like kinda bad being the only one getting stuff, so here take a soccer uniform top. Okay, so remember, what we just happened there was a lot of science and points. Okay, so remember, it was gift wrapped, which is one point, three points for the item being over 10k, and then one additional point, we're assuming, because we're friends and not good friends or best friends. So that's an additional four points, right? Five points, four points, five points. Gift wrap, one, two, three, furniture, and then giving a present back. Yeah, five points. Okay, so, so we should be at 38 right now. Yeah, it's cool, man. Awesome. This is working swimmingly. It's just gonna take a little bit of time. All right. Dun 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 dun. Do 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 do. Rooney, I gotta get rid of this guy. Oh, yeah, I'm just, no. Yeah, anyway, here we go. Okay, ooh, that violin. You are expensive, girl, dang. Ooh, how about this? Please be 10K. 5-4, oh, that's so cheap. Yikes. Fancy violin, oh my goodness. Oh my gosh, no, you're so expensive. <laughs> Fourteen times the amount that I should be giving her right now. But you know what? It's me cataloging these items too. So I'm just gonna have it in my catalog. That's not even worth it. Actually, I'll pass. Yikes, though. Ugh. Come on, Audie. Why you gotta do me like that? I hope you enjoy this, man. The best character. You better. Dun, 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 dun. Yo, she's a gold digger. Make you want more up up. No, that's the wrong that's the wrong song. That's a man eater. I will not bust into the other gold digger song by who sings that? <laughs> she's a man eater. <laughs> well technically. Eating all my bells right now. <clears> hmm. <throat> She'll make you wish you never ever met her at all, man. Look at that. My bank account's draining right now. I could use the Nook catalog. That's a good idea. But I'm really here for actually exploring my... Expanding. I'm sorry. Expanding my Nook shopping catalog. So I'm going and I'm shopping for these other items that I don't necessarily have before. Well, that's a good idea, though. Absolutely. Just like ordering five of one thing. That's like really borderline cheap. That costs like 10k. How many of you guys have something that's like 10k, like right on the money? What's exactly 10k or a little bit above there that you can shop for? I'm honestly curious. Uh, housewares. Da -da 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 -da. I wish there was a way of sorting by sell. 
Oh, there is. Oh, 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 here we go. Dang, Robot Hero. Oh my gosh, Robot Hero sells for like a quarter mil? There's a lot of things that sell for right around 10K. Dang, I'm looking at it right now. I'm looking around. That fountain is pretty good. Ooh, Tourist Telescope. I don't think you could reorder that. Iron Shelf. Iron Shelf t sells for 10.5. But it's a craftable item. I don't know if I can craft Iron Shelf. But it's craftable and you can't reorder it, so that's kind of a bummer. All uh, right, there's got to be something. Audie, where are you? Audie, I'm home. Audie's house. Coming in. Snack machine for 10K. I mean, the tennis table? No, I'm, no, I'm getting this completely wrong. Hey, DIY. I don't know if this works, though. Like, this is me talking to her once a day. But she's got a DIY right now, so... Um, nothing much. I'm just gonna say nothing much just so I get the credit for talking to her. And I think if she's too busy crafting, I think this is gonna be um, a missed day because I don't think I could give a gift whenever she's crafting. What do you guys think? Let me know in the comments. Yes or no? Simple answer. Can I give her a gift when she's crafting? A simple yes or no. I already know this DIY, great. Oh, wow, a lot of people saying yes. Yeah, there we go, we've proven it. Right there, do you want this? Here you go. Oh, what is it? Good. Myth busted, done, right here. This is a violin, girlfriend. This costed me an arm and a leg. That's like a loan, I had to take a loan out. Fancy violin, beautiful. Are you like for sure sure that I can have this? Yeah, so you remember that dialogue that pops up? Okay, so then we get an additional five from that. Remember, it's going to be three from giving furniture, one from giving it gift wrapped, and then another if she gives me an item. Presuming that we're in the friend zone. So that's adding five. One, two, three, four, five. Now remember, um, it could be, we could be off by a little bit. Which is fine. It's absolutely fine if we're off, but we'll uh, we'll adjust that later. So that's decent. So what can I reorder? What's a 10k item? My goodness. No, I need some more 10k items. This is really ridiculous. I'll go inside the shop and see what's up. What can I buy from the shop? Do 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 do. 17k? Okay, I'm going, I'm going. Here we are, here we are. Ants, watch out! Okay, okay, here we are. Something that's exactly 10k for science. What is it? What is it? An antique chair. That's it. Antique chairs. <laughs> that's gonna be so easy. Oh, look at this nasty, yellow, ugly looking kitchenette set. System kitchen? How much? No! No, I'm done. I'm done. I do not want to catalog the nasty looking yellow one that the 1970s called. Are there minus points if you time tra travel or neglect your villagers? No, Hannah Abel, there are not any minus points if you do time traveling or neglecting. The only way that you're gonna um, lose out on points is if you give them garbage, you get two minus points. And uh, if you give them trash for their birthday, you get five minus points, apparently. And uh, there's some other things like involved, like like shoving them or hitting them with nets or something like that, but I don't really want to cover that stuff. It's not really, there's no point in doing it. But yeah, if you neglect them, no, you just stay at zero. They don't ever, they don't ever go negative, apparently. Okay, antique chair, please tell me I have an antique chair. That would be amazing. Yeah! There we go. Yo, we are right here. Her house is going to be filled to the brim with antique chairs. All right, I think we're set for a while. I can forget the catalog stuff. I can catalog stuff off screen. Let's just make this a little bit quicker. Yo, what you know about antique chair? 
Or high-end stereo. Oh, high-end stereo is also a thing. Antique chair, high-end stereo. That's it. That's really the only... Th oh, and den desk. There's three things. There's three things that you can get. Antique chair, high-end stereo, and den desk in order to optimize this on the cheapest way possible. <laughs> Yo, don't be a cheap date now. Come on now. I'm sorry. I spent 18 times the amount that I should have. So let's just say we went on 18 dates on one time. We like splurged our, our entire uh, month saving for that. Uh, unlocking the catalog app. You just keep on ordering your Nook shopping stuff. I don't really remember the number. You keep on ordering like five things every single day and then like it'll just automatically come on board. I was gonna make that into a video, but then that'd be like a one minute video. So I didn't really wanna do that. Maybe I'll like slip that in with some other things that you may not have known in Animal Crossing. So there's the answer and there's the answer for you. Spread the word. Every single day, add that part of your daily task. If you guys especially if you guys are traditional players, if you guys play tradition, make sure that you order five nook item things, whatever it is, the cheapest thing possible, and then you'll be set. A lot of you guys are saying a hundred. Again, it could be a hundred. I don't know. I didn't. I didn't really pay attention and count them one by one. So that's the word on the street. Isabel. I want to give Isabel some gifts, right? Chelsea. Hey, what's up, Chelsea? Where are you? I don't know if you're in the chat. Talk to me. Items, items, items. She's giving me a whole bunch of junk. She's giving me the same shirt twice. Like, what's her problem? Yo, mom's tissues. Hey, there you are, Chelsea. Hi, how are you? I don't know why the little... No, the thing did pop up, right? I don't think I saw it in chat, though, so I don't really know what's going on with that. But, either way, thanks so much for coming. All right, so we got, oh, what did I do? Oh, I just dropped it, I'm sorry. I was like, where did it go? Okay, antique chairs, man. <laughs> Yo, dude, this is so optimizing. So now I don't have to worry about presents because I got these presents for her. Okay, cool. Presents are here. DIY I can dump off. She gave me a soccer uniform. A ball? <laughs> Have a ball! <laughs> Alright, get rid of this. This is my little DIY dumping grounds. I'm gonna bring these over to your house, okay? Dodo codes. Let's go. Let's see them right now. I'm gonna interrupt my entire tutorial about science in order to visit your town. Not ever gonna do that. I'm just messing with you. No, we got science to do. I'm not visiting anyone today. Sorry. For science! Oh, dang! You're, you're out playing? Where are you playing? Where are you playing, girl? You're playing with my heart right now! Get over here! Where are you? Oh my gosh. Audie, where are you? You're in the first spot that I met you. And if Gulliver ends up show- Oh, there you are. Hey. Hey! Hey, hold on. You're not leaving. You're gonna give me something. No! <laughs> Absolutely not. Don't go. Yikes. So regardless of what- Regardless of what, like, friendship status you have, they, there's a random chance that they're just gonna up and leave. I don't think so, but I'm gonna take I'm gonna take a point for talking to you. All right, just saying hi, girlfriend. Nice shades, though. Okay, so I got my point for that. This is yours. Here we go. Yo, put her in boxes, man. No way. Yo, we got a mission today. 
Here we go, enjoy. I hope you enjoy this antique chair for exactly 10k. Let's see if for science does this work. Yeah, yeah, absolutely, 10k, right there. Beautiful. That's an additional five pointers, so we're at 50 right now. Oh man, this is this is actually going pretty swimmingly. And, and uh, yeah, she gave me a cushion. So I think we're still in friend zone. Honestly, yeah, yeah, I think we're in friend zone right now. So here's the five. Okay, here we go. Let's go, let's go. Let's do it. Yeah, we're done. Adios. See ya. See you tomorrow. Fifty audio points right now. Let's go. Hello? Weird. <laughs> Hello? Well, I have Audi when you could have Kiki. I have Kiki. Audi's just cooler. Kiki's been around since like day one Animal Crossing, right? Right? That's like an OG Animal Crossing villager, Kiki. I don't know. Sounds old. Antique chairs, though. Yo. <laughs> Antique chairs, high end stereos, and then den desks. I think for science, I need to sell her a cute sofa. I think for science, we have to do something at like 9,600. Just to show you guys that 10K is the benchmark. I think we have to do it. I think we have to do it. And cute sofa is at the only thing in between 10,000 and like 9,500. Cute sofa. I don't think I've ever seen a cute sofa, so I'll see. And maybe if one of uh, one of my mutual friends out there wants to mail me a cute sofa, I'll check my mail and pick it up. You cute sofa havers. I don't know if I have cute sofa. Let me see. It's under C, right? I will buy one. I'm good. Don't send me a cute sofa, I got one. <laughs> the cute set. All right, let's go, Audi, I'm coming. Get out of here, you dog. Don't look at my weeds. I'm growing those. Oh, who's that, who's that, who's that? Oh, boo. Sorry, you were a cool dog when I first met you, but. Hey, jumping, doing some dances, there we go. Yeah, yeah, high knees, baby. High knees. Staying trendy, Foxtrot? Uh, yeah, I'll be seeing you. I just wanted my one point. Okay, so I'm grabbing my one point right there just for talking to her for the day. Let's see. What do you need? Do you want this? I heard you needed antique chairs. Here you are. Yeah, yeah, there we go. Thanks, I love this color. I'm so going to show it off. Okay, so she didn't have... She didn't say that one thing. Interesting. She's giving me an item every single time. What the heck did I get Nook Miles for? I gotta add the five, right? Should be five, presumably. True friends! Look, look, look! So now, I think it's safe to say... True friends, it's good to have good relations are our cornerstone of island development. So I think we say right now, since I got that, that we are officially the next friend up. I think we're good friends now. So that means if I add the five right now, one, two, three, four, five. Good friends is when you're at 60 points. So remember that I've taught I said at the beginning I've talked to Audi a handful of times. So that means that maybe since we started at the default 25, maybe I talked to her four times during this last month, just randomly. It could be that. Or it can be anywhere from let's see. Um I could be at 60 right here. 
So you know what? I think for science, let's just go on the low ball end of it. Again, because I, I don't, there's no way of me telling right now unless I had a brand new villager in my town. Um, and I've never talked to them once. I think for now, I'm just going to round up to 60, which is pretty safe to say. So I'm going to do that. One, two, three, four. Because now we, we became a new step in friendship, uh, which is going to be when you're at 60 points. So now the next step of friendship is going to be when I hit 150 points. So that's going to be double with what I am right now. True friends. So we'll see. We'll see. Remember, again, this is all, this is all testing. It's all theory. There's no hard science yet until I make the video a little bit later. So thanks, Audie. Enjoy that. I'm going to give her the sofa next, just to see what she, uh, what she says. Ba -bum, bum -bum. So what do you guys think? Pretty fun. Pretty cool concept, right? Uh, hold on, I don't know if I did that right. Pretty cool concept of testing out friendship and uh, favoritism. 10? Oh, dang, what day is today? Eh, whatever, I'll just go two days, doesn't matter. Wait, no, I'm just gonna go 11 in case I missed that. And skipping a day of talking to them doesn't do anything. And then I'm just gonna reset just in case. Just, just in case, covering my tracks here. All right, so now we're gonna test out one other thing of what will she say when you give her something that's not 10K? But see now, so whenever I am at a good friends level, I get an additional two bonus points every time they give you an item. So remember, it was gift wrap item plus the three points for uh, furniture, which is four by default. Now, since it's going to be good friend status, which we saw from the Nook Miles little thing coming on board, we're going to get an additional six. Theoretically. And if this holds true, then we should be all right. So we should be around like 60 to 64 approximately right now. 60 to 64 friendship points. We'll see. Dun, 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 dun. You can give them anything. You can give them anything. Maybe I should test out giving them an even 10,000 bells. I don't know. Yeah, I don't I don't think so. I think that's just going to be if you give them bells, you're going to get one friendship point for that one. And then that might trigger the um the gift exchange. Okay, cool, cool. All right, antique chairs. Your pudge. Where are you? I'm coming over. Come find you? No. Ew. Where the heck are you? Oh! No! Okay, fine. Thank you. Dun 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 dun. Uh, I'm a little distressed looking for Audi right now. Wow, look at that gigantic butterfly I don't care about. Where the heck are... Oh, good. Doing some stretches by the beach. What's up? All right, adding the one. I'm looking perf as ever. See ya! I'm looking perf? No one says that. Do people say that? They look like short for perfect? Oh my gosh. Anyway, here we go. This is a brand new antique chair. It's your third one or fourth one, I don't even know. Oh yeah, we were gonna test out the, the sofa thing. Yeah, yeah, we were. Thanks, Loki been wanting something like this for a while. Still going to show it off in my house as soon as I figure out where to put it. Here, I'll trade you. It's a plasma ball. 
Have a ball. What the heck is a plasma ball? Oh, is that the thing that you like touch and like it has electricity in it? Okay, so that should be a plus six. Hypothetically. Once I'm done with all of the antique chairs, I'll wrap that sofa. Looking perf, Audie. Looking perf. <laughs> Looking perf. That's not even a thing. No one says that. Looking perf right now. You guys, you know what? All 2,600 of you guys are absolutely looking perf. Trust me. You guys look great. And I know half of you guys aren't wearing pants. It's fine. It's quarantine life. I'm not going to tell you if I'm wearing pants or not. I might be wearing the perf pants. They're so perf on me. Just messing with you guys. You guys are perf. I'm looking perf as well. Hey, thanks. <laughs> that perf life. Perf life? Hashtag perf life? I don't know about that. That sounds so stupid. It sounds like you're just trying to get something trending. You know, like, no, absolutely not. <laughs> Sorry, Audie. I think I like everything about you besides that phrase. So let's just not ever do that. Jacqueline, what's going on? Jacqueline, hey, welcome. Thanks so much for becoming a member today. Glad you can join us for this awesome love connection we're having here. Did you guys watch that show on TV yesterday? It's called the series season finale. Season finale. Season finale of Westworld season three. What'd you guys think of it? Hands up in the comments if you guys watch. I'm not gonna spoil anything, but let me tell you. Harv's Island is Westworld. True story. Harv's Island, you could spawn clones of people just like that. Done. Spawn clones of Audi that teleport to the next room that you're automatically walking into before you even walk into it. It's Westworld, man. All right, Audie likes the beach. That's Kiki over there. Yeah, I'm coming in. Let's see how many uh, chairs you have. She said she was going to put them in her house. Just... Hey, okay, so you have one that she put in her I don't think... Uh, maybe there's something in the coding that says she's not going to put duplicates of things in the house. There's the violin I gave her, though. What happened to the washer? Okay, so I'm just going to talk to her for my one point for the day. Uh, we're going to get this DIY just for the heck of it. A cardboard sofa. Hannah Overton, what's going on, Hannah? Hi. Welcome. Welcome, Hannah. I'm going to say that this... This antique chair that's gift wrap from you to Audie. Here you go. This one's from Hannah. Next member gives another thing to... <laughs> gives it to Audie. I hope this is it. I blindly chose that. Wait, for realsies? All right. Thanks. Loki been wanting something like this for a while. I'm still gonna show it off in my house as soon as I figure out where to put it. Here, I'll trade you. It's a cycling shirt. I hear you love those. <laughs> no, I don't. But thank you. I'm adding the six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Count that math. Is that right? Sometimes I might misclick. So you guys are math count crew, right? <laughs> Out of here, guy. Oh, Sahara. Ah, we're okay. I'm good on that. Um, yeah, I should really uh, count that. Can one of you guys go back and um, scroll through? Mods or someone. Can you scroll back and see how many points I had before I added the six? Because my little button pressing thing is a little off. So I want to be as accurate as possible. 
And again, remember, it's just a, uh, it's just approximations. I added seven, subtract one. All right, you guys, better be right. I'm trusting. That, look at me out here trusting random comments. Yikes! Did I wake up on the wrong side of the bed here? <laughs> just kidding. Just kidding. All right, so we should be at 74. Yeah. Okay. Good. Good. Thank you. Lobo 13, enjoy getting Audie's affection up. Uh, if you can, try giving her a kimono. I don't think I have a kimono for her. But um, that's a good idea. Give her some actual clothing items. I mean, you can. But if you're going to try to uh, optimize the Audie's affection, or anyone's affection, you want to do that 10k item. You can give him a, a, a favored shirt but it's just not going to give you as many points. Hey, it's Suki Baby. Hello. <laughs> What's up, Suki Baby? Watched you since Yokai Watch. Glad you do Animal Crossing New Horizons. Oh, I'm so glad you enjoy Yokai Watch. That truly is one of my favorite franchises. If anyone were to ask me, like, what's your favorite franchise? Yoke Guy Watch. Any Yokai Watch fans here? Hands up in the comments. Let's see them. Cat emojis for Yokai Watch fans. For Jibanyan, right? I still have a Jibanyan on my desk. He's right there. He's cute. He's all the way over. He's like out of hand, out of arm's reach, so I can't really grab him. All right, so I have. Audie's been giving me these nasty shirts, but. Whatever. Here's a present. This is my last chair. So since it's the last chair, I'm going to order... Don't I have the cute sofa in my mail? Oh, dang! Audie wrote me a letter! Oh, dang! What? Wait, why is it happy home... I thought I ordered the cute sofa. Where the heck is it? It's in my pocket, isn't it? What the heck? I got so much junk. Where the heck is my cute sofa? Here it is. Got it. All right, so cute sofa is gonna be right here. Yo, should we read Audie's letter? I think it's gonna be. I think it's not. <laughs> I don't think we should should read it. At least not yet. All right, so this present's gonna be in the bottom corner here. This is going to be the cute sofa. We're gonna do it the day after tomorrow. Deal. Benjamin Baker. Yo, can you open your door so you can visit? Sorry, man. We're not having any visitors during this live stream. We got science to do. So that is not happening. But thank you for the super chat. Hey! Found you. Add one, 75. You're looking perf as ever? No, you're looking perf as ever. Let's talk. You're looking perf as ever. Alright, anyway, here we go. This is yours. It is another antique chair. Now you have five of them. Wrapped in gold. Only the best for Audie. A heart apron. Oh, wow. A heart apron. Oh, man. Okay, so that's great. That is adding the six. That's going to be 81. There we go. Yo, those double clicks on that thing. Yikes. All right, so I think we're good. Thanks, Audie. Nice to know you. Do, 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 do. Bum, 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 bum. For science! Alright, here we go. Getting that big science here. I think we're a little over halfway there. These are going really fast, too. Audie's just, like, floating around her house, which is great. I'll have to look in the museum for her. No, I don't have to worry about that. <clears throat> So, which villager, once we have actually brought on board a lot of this science and we've condensed it down, which villager are you guys going to go seek after their portrait? T. 
Tia Lopez. Oh, interesting. Cookie. Oh, you got Cookie too? Oh, that's pretty cool. Trying to get that fauna. Oh, dang. I want Freya, Cell Dweller. Once you get that portrait, put her in boxes for me. I'll come over. Because <laughs> that's the thing, right? Before you have a villager, like, leave your town, you want to make sure that you get their framed photo. Am I the only one that thinks that? I don't think that. I think an optimal play, yes, for sure. Okay, no one there. Audie on the beach. Dang, that's a party over there with Leaf. Yo, Mr. Erickson over there. Mr. Erickson is having a party. He's like, here, take these bushes. Pudgy. I'm coming. No. Where are you? Where are you? I don't have time for this, 81 Audi hearts. Are you over here? Nope. Kyle gang? Who the heck is Kyle? All right, let, let me ask that again. If you, once we get all the science down of like what this looks like in a visual, nice presentation, which character are you going to work on getting their framed photo first? Say their name and their species and a quick description of what they look like. Because remember, there's like over what, 400, 500 animals in this game or something like that? I don't know. I can't possibly recognize all of them outside the, the flagship ones. Dude, where's Audie? Come on, girl. She's probably like in the backyard of my house, man. What's she doing over there? Don't look at my gallant statue. I know you guys like it. Audi <laughs> Shredder. Catherine Hart. Hey, what's up, Catherine? Good to have you. I cannot find her for the life of me. Oh my gosh, where the heck are you, girlfriend? It's probably in Timmy and Tommy's. Or in Abel's. The first time. Hornsby the Lazy Rhino? What? Is that a thing? Uh, nope. Sorry. Yo, first love started with Sable, right? First started with Sable, and then now we've evolved to Audi. I don't want to go all the way over to the museum. I'm probably just going to skip this day, to be honest. Just, like, for the sake of time. Like, I don't have time to be running around playing Where's Waldo. Oh, give me that arcade machine, though. I don't think I have that one. I might. I got the Mahjong one. Nintendo 64,000. I'll take it. I'll give that to Audi. I don't care. Here. She might like that. She might like video games. Where is it? Arcade combat game? Yeah, I'll give that to her. I don't need it. Just got it on the catalog, though. You guys want that Imperial Shell? Some of you guys like that. I'll put it on my catalog in case I need to order it for someone, I guess. I do like the wall shelf. I wish it was customizable, like, not, like, throw it on the customization. I wish, like, I can throw, I don't know, like, a gold rose on it or something. I wish I could throw a gold rose on it. Or, I don't know, like, my bug trophy or something within it. I wish it was customizable like that. <clears throat> Audie, this is the last time I'm looking for you. I'm going to the museum. If you're not there, I'm skipping the day. All this trash, though. It's time for Audie. Now, where do the villagers go? Fossil section? I remember seeing people. She's probably on the beach. Watch. Have you seen her in, or any villager in like the butterfly exhibits or something like that? I could have sworn I've seen some other things, some people over here. Audi, what's up Katie OD? What's going on, welcome. Hey everyone, welcome Katie. Hello Katie, How? hi, how are you? All the rooms, oh my gosh. You guys have seen? You guys have seen them in all the rooms? I'm out here trying to find Audie. She's like right outside of her house. I was here the whole time. 
I wish you can open up the mini map. <clears throat> I wish you could open up the mini map and um, you know what? I'm done with today. We'll just go tomorrow. <clears throat> I wish you could open the mini map and see where exactly everyone's at. But again, that's not like realistic, right? Animal Crossing strives to be a realistic game. Not like you have GPS trackers on all your animals. Like it's not possible. That'd be pretty cool. I should like tag them all, like right in their ear. Like right in Audie's ear, just put a little chip. Or right in the back of their neck. <laughs> Come out with like a little tag gun. They go, oh, what was that? And I'll say, oh, it's just a mosquito. Sorry, mosquitoes are in season right now. Um, I just smacked one on the back of your neck, so don't even worry about it. <laughs> and then now, you have access to where they're all at. You can see them inside their house. You can see them inside the nooks shopping. But I wasn't about to go look through, like, six more rooms of the bug and the... Oh, and the paintings, too. I wasn't about to go look in the paintings for her, either. So we're just going to skip the day and hope she comes. Come on, Isabel, let's go. Come on, Audie, please, let's go. <sighs> All right, so Audie likes the beach. I'm gonna take a look over here at the plaza. Okay, it's KK time. She likes this beach. Although, I should look at the West Beach too. Hey, there we go. Beauty looking back. All right, 82. Let's chat. Talk to me. Tell me your name. Yo, you are being famous right now. You got like 3,000 people watching you, Audie. Do you want this? <laughs> I don't remember what I even gift wrapped anymore. I, I don't know what these things are. This one was the last antique chair. No, that was a sofa, right? Pff, whatever, here. This was the the game, the arcade game. I gotta empty out my pockets. Yeah, the arcade game. Oh, forgive me. Okay, you love this color. Go to show it off. As soon as you know where to put it, uh, say thanks, but with an object. It's an astro dress. Hey, I, I'm gonna wear a dress, thanks. Okay, so that's the plus six. 82 plus six is 88. So let's get up to 88 right now. And we should be all set. Thanks, Audie. It's easy. And I don't need to order anything right now, so I'm good. <clears throat> 88 out of 150. 88 out of 150. Almost there, right? Once we hit that best friend status, though. And I want to see how accurate our number count is based off of when that Nook Miles ticket uh, achievement goes on. You know, like... Ding dong, ding dong. Like, will we hit it right when we breach that? Because right now, I think we're approximately, like, maybe four. Like, the variance is, like, four to five right now. So, we'll see what we do when it hits it. So, what do you guys have planned for Monday? <clears throat> Anything interesting? Anything cool happening within the week? Talk to me. Let's uh, let's talk about what you guys have going on during this week. Me? What do I have going on? We're playing some Animal Crossing. Came up with some science ideas to test out. And I'm going to play some Mario Kart Tour tomorrow. Mario Kart Tour tomorrow, right around this time, I'm going to say. And then tomorrow, like late night, like around midnight to like 1 a.m. I'm gonna stream Mario Kart Tour's new tour, which is fun. Like right around 1 a.m. Central on Wednesday. It's gonna be staying up. It's gonna be party time. We do that once every two weeks. So if you guys like staying up, if you guys are night owls, come join me. It'll be a fun time. 
Even if you don't like Mario Kart, just come and just be a chill audience with me. It'd be great. Some of you guys, hi, hi, you got some homework playing Animal Crossing. Pretty cool. Whitney. I gotta start working on Whitney, too. This is a very long process, though. Like, no joke. I think that if I get Raymond... If I get... If I ever get Raymond, I will do this process for Raymond, and that's it. Hi. I lost my voice. Trying to be a heavy metal singer. Okay. That's cool. Thank you. Thanks for the one point. Yoink! Diana looking strange today. Do you think she's sick? Okay, so this is also for science. You can get additional points for this one. Maybe you should go check on her. So, watch, watch. We're gonna do this. I don't know where Diana's house is, but I need to go check on her, and then I'm gonna go get her medicine. This is where you can get additional points for doing uh, little favors for them. I just want to show you guys that you can do it. Of course, it's not... Uh, it's not mandatory by any means like you don't have to do it But I don't know if you're trying to optimize you do your like seven and done for the day, but we'll see Don't look at that roach <laughs> All right. Anyway, let me go find Diana You know honestly, I don't really want Diana in my town anymore. Where's my medicine? Okay, I need to get rid of this junk though so let's get rid of this soccer top uniform. Let's get rid of a ball. Soccer. You gave me two soccer uniforms, girl, and a cushion? All right. And then you gave me some other nonsense. Heart apron. Cycling shirt. Plasma ball. Uh, Astro dress. This is Imperial shelves. Okay. And then this, I don't remember this one. That was probably the sofa, right? All right, let's go find Diana really quick. <clears throat> and then I think you have to report back to her, saying, like, you checked on Diana and she was just sick. All right, so remind me where Diana lives. Diane. <laughs> let's go, Diana. Are you bedridden? Are you sick? <clears throat> oh, you are feeling sick. Whew. Better get that fever checked out. Medicine delivery. I love your house, by the way. I hope I didn't just give you four medicines. I do not want Diana to overdose over here. It's just one dose. What happens when you have a stack of four? She eats them all? Oh, good. I don't have the DIY for a gravestone. I don't. Yikes. Hey, I checked up on her. Uh-huh, uh-huh. So that- what did that give me? <clears throat> what did that give me? I thought that- I thought that that would- I don't know. If you talk to the sick villager and do not give medicine the first conversation, you will lose the performance bonus. It gives you points for Diana, maybe. I could have sworn. You will receive additional two friendship points if you return to the correct villager. Uh, hold on a second. Uh, so that's a little unclear with this guide here. Uh, the villager will be, will be sick in their home and will ask you to bring them some medicine. Yeah, it's probably just for Diana. That's lame. Well, good thing. Did we already do Audie's present for the day? I don't think I did. Yeah, I could have sworn that would be like, hey, like, hey, what's her name sick? Go help her. And then you come back to Audie and then it's like, oh, hey, thanks for helping her. Here's an extra friendship point. It's not the case. <clears throat> Here we go. So this is what? 
cute sofa? Okay, so remember, cute sofa was not 10,000. Are you like, for sure, for sure. Thanks, Abdallah. Loki been wanting something like this for a while. Oh, I've been thinking maybe it's time to trend up the old abode. I'll decide where to put this. Here, I'll trade you at some full body tights. I hear you love those. So that's interesting. So this was, um, I think this was a coin flip. And I think I need to test out these coin flips even more. Because it was more along the lines of... If your gift sells for less than that amount, the villager has a 50-50 chance of giving you bells and a 50% chance of giving you items. Interesting. Bells or items. So either way... Interesting. <clears throat> so it really doesn't matter, the 10k. Now that I'm looking at this, as long as it is... If your gift sells for less than... 2,500. Interesting. So how many points did we just get right here? This has got to be the gift wrap present. Three of them, because it is a furniture. And then the two, because we're good friends. One, two. She did give me something, right? Yeah, you gave me full body tights. That's seven. Have I been miscalculating? I don't know. Let me see. Gift wrapped. Three for furniture. Two. Oh, no, that's six. Yeah, six. It's just six. So 89 plus six is going to be 95. 95. <clears throat> so that's a, it's a coin flip. It's a coin flip. Give me a gift that sells for, <clears throat> that costs a thousand bucks even. And that's really going to be the best way to budget this, now that I'm thinking. Because if you don't want an item in return, like a guaranteed 100% item in return, you don't have to give them something that sells for 10000 That's expensive. Yo, if you want to be a cheap date, if you want to be a cheap date, give her something for 250 that that costs 1000 bells. Interesting. So let's test out some 1000 bell stuff. I was going for 10k for the guaranteed item every single time. But, like, I guess what we should do is do a couple more cute sofas to see if she gives me bells, because that's the 50-50 coin flip. I'll do a couple cute sofas, and then we'll find something that sells for a thousand. Yeah, that's awesome. Something that sells for a thousand. In the shop. An even 1,000. It's going to be um, a fortune-telling set. Okay. I can order some fortune-telling sets. And a nail art set sells for about 1,000 too. All right. This is really exciting for me now. Because now it's like, all right, here are some variables that we want to see in order to be the cheapest date possible. Right? I started out like, here's a, hundred, here's a violin that costs 160,000. Enjoy it. And then we just brought it down to 10k, you know, little um, what antique chairs. And then now we're kind of like borderline underneath that with cute sofa. So I'm going to do fortune telling set and then cute sofas, which should be good. And then I should just sell something like dinnerware, for example, that's like really dirt cheap. Like she won't even give me anything back for bonus points. <clears throat> okay, anyway, what am I um what am I gifting here? DIY recipes. Sorry. I'm ordering cute sofas, and then we're gonna do five cute sofas. Okay, there's five cute sofas. Uh, I can't really order anything else, so I'm just gonna wait for that to show up. And then I have, I don't even remember what this was. Like, that's not something that's there. All right, I need to dump some stuff. Okay, drop. 
drop. We got that money in our pocket. Don't cardboard sofa. Did I already know this? Yeah, I already. My stomach is too full. I cannot eat any more DIY recipes. Here we go. Drop. I don't need the medicine yet. I'll drop it nearby. And then now I'm at a spot where I need something to test. So let's see if they've got the fortune telling set and or the nail art set. Maybe we'll test something today. Oh, look at this, a toilet, what's this? Hey, perfect, sewing box, a thousand bells. Beautiful. A sewing box. Alright, so now if I talk to them and I sell the sewing box, it's got to be for 250, which is the benchmark for like being a cheapskate. Yeah, absolutely. Because they, um, they buy back at a quarter of the price. Okay, so perfect. So now we can find out if we are, um... Wow, that's interesting. If we're gonna get a 50-50 shot of getting bells as a present, or, oh, I should buy some more of them. Sorry, I should actually buy a whole bunch of them. Sorry. Because I wanna test more than once. I'll buy like four more of them. And then I'll wrap them all up, and then that's gonna be a thousand. And then we're gonna try to do something that's under a thousand. Like five of each should be fine. All right, here we go, buy that, yep, thank you. That's crazy though. If, um, if you're gonna get the same desired result uh, from a 9,600 item versus a 1,000 item, you're gonna get the exact same result and the exact same points. Then that's science right there. You can be a cheap date and get away with it. It's perfect. All right, here we go. One. Oh my, what's what? Ugh. I had some weird random present here. I don't even know. Let me let me open that. What is this? Get out of here, sturdy sewing box. What is this? Star shades. What am I doing with this? Get out of here. Why was that even in my pockets? All right. You know, we need a little bit of organization here. Take these star shades. Get them out of my face. Although I could have used that to give to Audi. <laughs> Whatever, it's fine. Here we go, so sturdy sewing box. I'm gonna put my money up here. Just so I have like shelves, right? I wish there was an easier way of like moving your in-hand inventory. Okay, so the first five over here are going to be the sewing sturdy box. Sturdy sewing box. I'm gonna gift wrap all of these. And then I'm gonna check my mail because I should have five sofas coming tomorrow, which is going to be, if our hypothesis is correct, it should have the exact same result. Now getting, landing heads on five coin flips in a row is very not likely. But I'm curious though, how many guys are mathematicians out there? What are the odds of flipping a 50-50 coin and getting the same result five times in a row. What are the chances of that? It's possible. It's 100% possible, but like, what are the odds? Cat! What's up, buddy? Give me that one point for 96. Do you know what kind of TV shows Jess likes? I sure do. Okay, so I got my one point. Here we go. Do you want this? Now, remember, we're our, our current hypothesis is is an item that costs a thousand bells the exact same outcome as something that costs 9,600, which is in the middle. It's like that middle range. So she's either going to give me um, bells 
Or she's gonna give me an item. And then we're gonna keep mental note of if she gave me bells or item. So let's see. It's three sewing box. Are you like, for sure, sure I can have this? All right, so same dialogue, thanks. I love this color. I'm gonna show it off in your room. Okay, so... Oh, so she gave me bells. Yeah, okay. So there we go, that's, that's... It's either bells or an item. Great. 375. That's an interesting amount. So what did we get off of that? Now, we did give her furniture, which is three. It was gift wrap, so it's four. We're currently good friends, so that's six. 96 plus six is uh, 102, right? One oh two. I need to move some elements around. I totally forgot I was gonna be in. Oh my gosh, moving elements around takes forever. Here we go. Okay. I think that's uh, that's pretty good. So we just need to test that a couple more times. I mean, I got him. And it gives us the exact same amount of friendship, so it really doesn't matter. It's kind of based off of whether or not you want to be a cheap date and get something in return. If you want to be an expensive date, then 10k, you're going to get an item from them every single time. And I don't know, are you going to be collecting Audi items? Is that a thing? Should we make an Audi room? If that's the case, then I would have to take a look and see... Like, does she have a certain database of items that she'll spawn and give you? Does she re-gift things that your in-game villager give? There's just so many weird variables that I I don't even know if I want to spend time with. Does it matter? No, I don't care what Audie gives me. The only thing I want is her framed photo. And that's what we set out here to do, so let's go do that. Did I even adjust the day? I'm too busy talking. Do you guys know if I did? I don't think I did. Yeah, I don't think I did. Because she's like right in the exact same spot. Like, no. <clears throat> Too busy thinking about like other theories. That's fine. Good thing. Good thing you guys are paying attention. 102 though. We're almost there. We're absolutely almost there. And we're getting a lot of points per day too. This is great. <clears throat> so I need to find some things that are cheap. <laughs> that are like the dirt. What is the cheapest thing you can sell to Tom Nook? A packet of weeds? A singular packet of weeds. You're not going to get anything. You're not going to get any bonus. But the cheapest thing that you can get is this 1,000... It says 1,000 item, so I need to just make a list of all the 1,000 items. If that's what we want. A flower. <clears throat> the odds for getting 50%. <clears throat> uh, interesting. We'll see about that. A single weed. <laughs> She's gonna say, oh, thanks. <clears throat> Why would you want to give her a single weed? All right, Audie, where are you? We're coming up on that 150. Oh, Diana's oh catching bugs. 150 is not bad. Hey, Audie on the bridge. Nice. Today's a totally great day. Yo, what's the latest? Let me add my one for 103. Yeah, I do want to practice being pop stars together. But here, you can have this. It is a nail set that I got for a thousand bells. And you're either going to give me bells or an item. And I kind of just want to see the item. Oh, it's not the nail set. It's a sewing box. Ah, same thing. Yeah. 
Yeah, here we go. That's it. Yeah. Okay. So, I mean, there you go. There's your 50-50 shot. You're either going to get bells from those items. Thank you. So that was plus six. Uh, that's going to be 109. Wow. That's way too much. Double tapping over here. No, no, no. I was right. 109. There we go. <laughs> the weed sell for bells. It's like here's the new the new strategy on making money in Animal Crossing 2020. <laughs> Stock up all your weeds and sell them to leave. Said no one ever. Why in the world would Leaf just give you 20 bells per weed? That doesn't make any sense. Like, if he's all about, like, Earth Day and, like, I love, you know, trees and stuff like that and bushes and shrubs, like, why wouldn't he give you, like, a hundred bells a pop? So you're like, oh my gosh, like, let's go get these weeds. I can actually make some money. But, like, doubling it to 20? Like, that's silly. It's silly. You tell me. What do you guys think? Do you think that's, like, a, uh, like a low ball? Totally low ball, man. It's not even a thing. Like, he's out there trying to reward you for, for picking the weeds. He doesn't give you any custom items like he did in the previous game. Like, nothing. Leaf is pointless. Aside from buying bushes from him, there's no point in Leaf. Leaf's garbage. <laughs> Leaf needs to make like a tree. Wow. Leaf needs to make like a tree. Look at that. Big words today. This guy. This guy. Wait, I'm in 2021? When did that happen? Oh gosh, did I not go back after that one stream that we did? What was I, what was I skipping a year for? I know it's something with science. I didn't even, wow, I didn't even remember. What the heck? Something for science. Oh, it was for Mayday, wasn't it? Yeah, yeah, we were testing out Mayday for you guys. That's right, that's right. That's fine, that's fine. It was for Mayday. Look at this guy, he's still here. Get out of here. Bad bye, Leaf. Bad bye. Audie on the bridge? No Audie on the bridge. Dang. Audie, not at home. <gasps> Pumping weights! Dang. Working on that fig. That perf fig. Let's talk. Yes, you do. Thank you for the one point. That's 110. Here we go. I got some uh, some cool stuff for you. It's it's a really, really expensive thing that I spent a lot of money on. There we go. Cool. Relay tank. Okay, that's plus uh, six. So we're at 116. Beautiful. Dun 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 dun. Pudge. You guys like Pudge? Some of you guys like. Just likes Pudge for some reason. I gotta get rid of him though. Don't tell her. It's like I logged in. Oh, he's just magically gone. He decided to leave. I don't know. It's out of my control. Dun -dun 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 -dun. Make into 160. You know, I honestly don't think we have to do any other testing after we just get this picture. At the beginning, I said I was going to try to get to max 255, but that's just drawing out the stream for longer than it should be, to be honest. You really only just need that picture in there and you're done. I don't know, and this process is pretty long too, it's lengthy. But then there's also that thing, it's like, well, what happens when you become max friendship with a villager?
I don't I don't think they're gonna give you anything at 255. But again, you know, science, I can't confirm or deny. Alright, here we go. It's Audi time. Look at you, you got an idea? Oh, you got a grumble grumble? Yeah, sorry, not right now, guy. You're the one I want to move, though. He's gotta go. Oh, there you are. I see you. I see you. I see you. Here we go. Whew. Nice workout. Take a breather, okay? I'll, I'll give you a minute. Today is totally a great day. What's the latest? All right. Cue flowers and places uh, and hide things. Okay, so that's the, for the plus one. We're going to get that in 117. I have some more of these little sets for you. So a thousand is the best. Here we go. This is yours. I should have bought way more, because this is perfect. It sells for a thousand. What is it? What is it? I'm going to rip it open, okay? Let me see. A sturdy sewing box. Yes. Ah, give me money for it. Okay, that's fine. I don't care. All right, beautiful. So now we're going to add the six. Uh, that's going to be one, two, three. That's going to be 123. Oh, very close. One, two, three. One, two, three. Beautiful. Yes. Yes. Okay, so we have one more of those nail sets. I do have to check my mail to ensure those sofas are available because remember, we had to test the sofas after a little bit. Don't look at my peach baby. Dang, Audi's giving me a whole bunch of mail. Man, I wonder why. I wonder what triggered the mail. That's something I'm not really going to test for science, whether or not. We'll read all of Audi's stuff at the end. How about that? We'll read them from chronological order. Okay, so we got cute sofas. And we have one more little nail set, or sewing set. Okay, so this right over here, this present on the bottom row, is going to be the sewing set. And I can give it to her next time, that's fine. And then we're going to give a wrapping of this. We're going to give a wrapping of this. A wrapping of that. And a wrapping of this. Yo, that gift wrapping, huh? It's awesome. Okay, we did everything for the day. Let's move on. So, can any of you guys confirm, do they hand you their photo, or do they mail it to you? I saw a stray comment over here uh, that said something along the lines of, you might picture frame in the mail. I, I don't know. You let me know. Have you guys received one from another villager that was like your best friend? Okay, they hand it to you there. Beauty Rat, what's up? Beauty Rat, welcome! Hi, how are you? Cute shades in that profile picture. Who's that a picture of? Okay, so a lot of you guys are busting that comment of there might be the picture frame in the mail. So, a lot of you guys have. Again, I haven't tested it personally, but this is the word on the street. That's the word on the street. Beauty rat, welcome, big hype. Let's see some Isabel emotes. Yeah, let's do that. Now, Mystic Volcarona seems to be mistaken a little bit, so let me clear the air on what we're trying to do here. There's a difference between a villager's poster and a villager's framed photo. Okay, if you're just joining us right now, um, that's exactly what we're testing out here. Anyone can go to Harv's Island and grab one of their little villagers and take a picture of them and get the poster in two seconds. That's not what we're doing here. We are testing out the science of love and friendship to get the framed photo, which will take approximately 150 friendship points. 
Thanks for watching. Audis making some stuff. Dun 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 dun. dun. Who's here? Oh, whoa. Okay, you're not even doing anything. Oh, you got your two sewing boxes here? <laughs> They're just right. Oh, she's got the three sewing boxes. Yikes. All right, let's just talk. Whatever. I'm just filling your stuff up with sewing boxes. This is terrible. I feel so bad now. Did I hear your friend's name is Daisy? Yeah, yeah. All right, here we go. So that's my plus one for 124. What's up? Do you want to practice being pop stars together? Yeah, this is for you. I got one more of these little sewing boxes. I know you have plenty of them, but enjoy. Whoa, another sturdy sewing box? And she gives me bells. Beautiful. Thank you for the sewing box. Okay, so that's a six, and that's gonna be an even 130. One, two, three, four, five, six. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. We got this, guys. For science, right? Say it with me now, for science. Seems to be 20 more to go, approximately. Approximately 20 more to go. Approximately 20 more. Dun, 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 dun. Only a couple more days and we should be fine. <clears throat> So, yeah, there's different benchmarks. It's pretty crazy. There's different uh, favor levels, too. So, yeah, 150, that's going to be best friends. But 200 is considered the highest tier. There's only six tiers. Apparently. I think going to 150, getting this thing, is probably what we're going to stop at. Is there a max amount of points you can get in a day? Uh, it depends on what you do with them, to be honest. There's so many things that you can do. I'm I'm trying to do like a streamlined approach of seeing exactly like, okay, here we go. We're getting like six to seven points really quick by sending a, a quick gift. But there's other things that you can do too, such as like if they have a little fetch quest for them or if they're sick, you give them that stuff. Or if they have a little lost and found or they want to see a specific bug. There's so many other little things that you can get. But again, I haven't confirmed whether or not a single villager in one day will ask you for a a bug and then they'll ask you for a fish and then they'll ask you to find this thing. Like, I, don't, I have not confirmed all of that. Hey, don't say hi to Pudge. Say hi to me. Yeah, that's right. Today's a great day. What's the latest? All right, adding the number one, talking. Uh, here we go. Uh, I have classic sofas, or s cute sofas, which cost 9,600, which is right under the cusp of the 100% threshold for getting an item from her. So when we give this to her, and if she gives me money back, then that absolutely proves the 10K, the 10K benchmark. Okay, so that's a, that's a coin flip. We did the coin flip and we didn't get the money for it. So we have five more chances. But we did do this, so we're gonna get our additional six points. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. On seven, right? 137, beautiful. <clears throat> do, 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 do. Mm -hmm. I heard you love safety helmets. 
I wonder what the safety helmet looks like. Go Goku 7. Whoa, dude. What are you doing here? What's up, guy? How you been, man? Uh, Stephanie Schaller? I think I pronounced that right. Stephanie S. Welcome, Stephanie. Hi, how are you? Welcome. So glad to have you. Big hype in the chat. Nice. Isabel, we got the crazy ready mode. I don't know if you guys saw that. I'm sorry, he's not crazy. He's jolly. He's jolly. In the year 2020, you cannot call people crazy. It's rude. In the year 2020, you cannot officially call people crazy. That is not politically correct. You know, I think that emote turned out really good without the white stroke. Good job. The second revision was good. Pudgy! doing in my yard pudge don't oh rooney wants to go i'm um, trust me you're the first one to i'm gonna let you free i'm gonna let you free buddy oh don't be sick don't be sick Audie. don't be sick i don't have medicine on me hey just chilling don't sit down either <laughs> welcome to my place do you know what kind of drinks just likes I sure do. Sparkle water. What? I said sparkle water. <laughs> oh, she's got her arcade over here. I didn't even realize that that's what that was. Oh, cool. All right, so adding the one, which is 138, and then now we got these sofas. Presento. I don't know what you're gonna do with another cute sofa, but I want you to give me bells for this. Yeah. Okay. There. We, yeah. Absolutely. That is 100% confirmed. Yeah. The the threshold is 10k. 100% can confirm. The threshold for a 100% getting an an item from the villager is 10k absolutely tested i mean i didn't doubt it i just wanted to show on screen so i gotta add the six so that's going to be 144 one two three four five six yeah that's cool That's really cool that we were able to put some uh, some truth to that. So then the only thing that is kind of in the in the wings is like, what happens if I gift wrap a, a weed for her? <laughs> like 10 bells. Um, although I should find something that's 240 bells. What sells for 240 bells? How about that? Oh my, the barrel eye model? Let me see, 240 bells. I don't think I changed the date. I'm gonna do that. Um, 240 bells, what? So that's going to be 240 times four. Do the math. Two hundred forty times four. Nine hundred and sixty. Okay. So what? What sells for at Nook's Cranny for nine hundred and sixty? What sells at Nook's Cranny for 960? Just right under the cusp. 960. 
right under the cusp. Oh, dang. 960. Judge's Bell. Well, I have the Judge's Bell. Not The Judge's Bell sells for 920. That's right under the cusp. Right, because 980 divided by 4. Sorry, 980 divided by 4 is 245. Oh, actually, that could work. That's a little bit better. The Magic Kit. The Magic Kit is 245, which is the absolute underneath the cusp of that benchmark. So if I give her a Magic Kit, she should be able to give me nothing in return, which is something that I also want to test. Magic Kit, man. All right. And we're right at the point where she's going to become best friends, too. <clears throat> Magic hit. Oh, I gotta, I gotta go do that. Here we go. I think I bought one of those little silly things before, ages ago. Magic kit. There we go. Nine eighty. Yeah. So nine eighty divided by four is two hundred and forty-five. She's gonna give me this thing. She's absolutely gonna give me this. Um. Because once I talk to her now, we'll beat 150. And I don't know how that's going to happen, right? Because the the one talk to her is going to be 145. Oh, Siege. Yo, Siege is here. And then we're going to be at like 151 approximately. So let's see what's up. You are the best. You're just chilling in your house. I don't have to go looking for you. Quarantine life over here with Audi. All right, make yourself at home. This is going to be for my 145. Just talking to her. Just chilling. Yeah, that's right. That's right. You like this outfit. It matches my outfit in real life. It's cool. All right, here we go. Um, this is it for the drum roll. Are we accurate in our counting? I don't know, remember, for science. Testing for science. Uh, this is going to be our present. This should give us six points. And that should bump us into 150. And remember, we had a variance of at least four, so we could technically be at 149 right now. Okay, so this should get us into 161. Interesting. So something's not at play here. One fifty-one. One fifty-one. That's what I meant. So something's um, something's really weird here. So I don't know, like the exact trigger, and that's what I'm trying to do here. So maybe just go back in. Hey, I'm at one fifty-one. Like we should be best friends. And I didn't get the Tom the the um, the little pop-up for Nook Miles, either. So something in my calculations are off. Maybe 150 is not the benchmark, then. I don't know. Maybe it could be the next day, the instant that I talked to her. We'll go up to 200, I don't care. Like, at what point do you get the framed artwork? That's really what we're here for, too. I ordered one magic print. Dude, I thought that was honestly going to be it. I thought that the moment... The moment that we hit 151, or 150, or something like that. Remember, we had, like, a variance of maybe four. She's going to up and give it to us. But then we didn't get the little pop-up that says that. So, I don't know. Maybe you have to be the, the higher tier of best friendship. You have to be at 200. Um, so right now we're at a favor level of possibly level five out of six with 151 approximate points. I don't know. <clears throat>
Could be 200, I don't know. We're gonna find out. Remember, we're here for science, so that's exactly it. Anything that you guys say is all theory, so whatever theories you guys have, whatever. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna be testing my own theory here. If you guys have your own theories that you wanna talk about, feel free, like, test them on your own. I'm gonna go to 200 now, or at least we're gonna keep on going until one of the things trigger, and then we can kind of go back and say, all right, well, we miscalculated this, and this is where our numbers were a little off. So we'll see. Uh, robotic Pack, what's up, Robotic Pack? Thank you for the upgrade. Yeah, this is weird to me. But that's okay, that's what science is, right? If you have a hypothesis, and sometimes it doesn't go according to plan. You gotta keep on going. You gotta try a new hypothesis and you gotta somehow backtrack and find out where you went wrong in your scientific testing. But I mean, no one's really wrong per se. Just testing stuff out. All right, Audi body. I have more cute sofas and I do have a magic kit that's waiting for you. What you doing in your house? Thanks. Why are you wearing sunglasses at home? Yeah, I do. Stop asking me about that. All right, adding the plus one right now, just because we talked to her. All right, here we go. Uh, this is for you. Present. I'm giving you so many sofas. Oh, here we go! That's it! So, my variances were off by, like, maybe 10. Hey, I wanted to say thanks, but, like, with an object. It's Audie's photo. Enjoy. So, maybe... Okay, okay, so... Maybe our calculations were correct, but the only time that she gives you the photo is directly after that. We just needed to give her another opportunity to give a trade with us. Yo, we were right on board. No, we were on the money. With a variance of what, plus six, potentially? One, two, three, four, five, six. Technically, we are at 158. So if the variance is like plus minus 10, I think that's spot on. Absolutely. So, here's a question then. Um, here's the question then. How come I didn't get the trigger for best friends then? So, hold on, hold on. Oh, let me do this really quick. Let me show you guys what this is. This is the photo. There we go. So we got it. Ladies and gents, we're here. We got um, the wonderful In the Sunset. Audi framed artwork. I don't remember what the poster looks like. So this is this is what we got. So mission accomplished within exactly what we were doing here. So I like that, but I do want to take it a couple steps further. I do want to take it a couple steps further and I do want to see exactly what Nook Miles achievement we're going to get for becoming like the highest tier friends, which is right around 200. So very, very curious about this. All right, so let me know in the comments, do you guys have the best friends achievement in the game? And where is it and what is it called? Is it right, is it in between happy birthday and true friends? Like, let me know where that's at. Cause true friends, it's good news for Nook when island residents get along, good relationships are a cornerstone of island development. Um. Okay, so, like, I have a good friend status. I don't necessarily think that I'm, like, the best of friends. I made I made favor level 5 right now. But I didn't get this. Interesting. It's called True Friend? No, I mean, we're already on True Friends. Hold on. Hey, someone in the Discord, one of the Avengers, give me a picture of this if you have it. I need to actually take a look at this. All right, where are my Avengers at? Let's go. Jump it into the task chat if you have a picture of it. I need. I actually need this physical, physical picture. Is there another achievement 
for having the highest rank best friends. Because like technically right now, if I'm at 150-ish points and they gave me their photo, I'm technically considered best friends with 150 to 199 points. But then there's a tier above that, which is favor level six for 200 points. So yeah, give me the screeny. Give me the screeny of this. And I just need a screeny of like this page right here. And then if you want to give me a screeny of what this middle one looks like. While you guys are working on that, what's my move? You're going to get out of here. Not right now though. Um, while you guys are working on that, we just need to move on to the next day. And I'll go to 200 for science. For science. Oh, so crazy. Okay, so we got it, like, right on board. Mm, that's not necessarily what I'm... It's good news, a good relationship with Corner. So that's not what I'm looking for. No, not that one, Anka. No. Yes, this one. Uh, true friend's birthday celebration. Oh, okay. okay. So it, it goes, true friend's birthday celebration, happy birthday. What the heck is birthday celebration? No, I think it's more along the lines of there's no there's no achievement for having a best friend. Oh, sorry, I gotta go to the next day. I don't know. Let's test it for science, right? Like, so I'm getting screens of birthday celebration um, when you go to a birthday for someone else. That doesn't matter for anything here that we're testing, but it's good to know that that exists. So there, I don't, I don't believe that there's another achievement for having a, a favor level six, 200 plus points. But if testing is this easy, what do you guys say? Get to 200? What do you guys think? Let me know in the comments. Celebrating the birthday of a fellow resident is a wonderful thing. Nook Inc. will commemorate your bond with some party favor, Nook Miles. Okay, well, I don't know. 200 for science. What happens at 200? It's like the highest favor level. And then there's really no point in getting to 255 because there's nothing there, presumably. Dude. I'm almost at a point where it's like, let's just do another hundred more. Each of these is so fast to do. Like, let's just go. Let's get to 255. You know what? I think we're gonna do it. How often, how, lo how long have we been streaming? How much time do I got today? It's two o'clock? We've, we've got to 150 in about two hours. I think in one hour I can get to 255. I mean, it's for science, am I right? Let's let's figure it out together. Doo -doo 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 -doo. I hope just Audi doesn't play hide and seek on me though. That's the worst thing. Sweet. Imagine that you put their framed artwork right on the outside of their house. That's the massive flex to all of your friends that visit. All right, here we go. Add the plus one for talking. Thank you for that, Audi. I appreciate it. I hope you enjoy these sewing boxes. They're your favorite, I heard. I'm running out of them, so I need to go order some more. Okay, so now our... Ooh, ooh, we should be one more. I'm sorry. We should be one more point from the last gift that we gave. Presumably... If we were at 151 plus when we gave her that one present, that means that we get a bonus of three every time she gives us something in return. So I'm going to take one point right now. And remember, we have a variance of maybe plus minus 10 points here. Um, because all these item numbers, these numbers are hidden. So I think my variance is like right around maybe like that. So now, instead of getting six every time, we should be getting seven. 
because we are technically of the higher tier, which is the uh, favor level or five to six, which are we are considered best friends now. So good. So adding this, uh, remember, here we go. So it's going to be a gift wrap item, an item that's over 250 bell sell rate, which is three. It's a piece of furniture, so that's four. And then since we're we're best friends, we're getting an additional three points. One, two, three. So seven every time. So now we're getting eight points every single day at least. So yeah, here we go. So add the seven, which is 167. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. All right, that's good. It's really good. I need to go order some stuff, so let's do that. Um, we said that we were going to order a whole bunch more of those nail sewing kits. That was fine. It was called what? Or I could just order a fortune telling set. That's fine. She needs a new item anyway. Fortune telling set is another one that's like a thousand. And it's cheap and easy for these points, so I need to order five of them. But I will make the magic set her next thing to give her. Just showing. I've got so much junk in here. All right, uh, let's get out of here. Oh, what was that? What was that? Hold on. What What was I nook miling here? Nothing? Oh, it was just nook miles plus. Get out of here. I thought I'm like, okay, yo, we just triggered something. Cool, cool. Let's go. Do, 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 do. And even if we get to 255, I'll just do like another day and pretend that we're going to go to like 265 or 75 just to overcompensate for the potential variances that the hidden numbers are there. So just, we're not going to stop at our specific 1, 255. We're going to keep on going uh, for a little bit more. Uh, because again, doing this completely blind based off of what we think is happening in the background. But for the most part, like this is pretty good. This is pretty good. You can't tell what friendship level you're currently at. You can kind of tell based off of how they greet you. But that's that's really it. There's no like heart meter or anything like that in the game. So it's like how they greet you, how they talk to you. There's like, I don't know, man. I haven't looked at the flow charts, to be honest, of like the text dialogue boxes. Because how the game works is like, depending on what favor level you are. Okay, so she's by these houses here. She's by the yellow house. Um, it depends on what, what favor level you are. One through six, depending on like how good of a friend you are. And then based off of what favor level you are, you're going to get X dialogue to happen. So that's how like the coding works in the game. So unless you know your villager's personality type, one out of like the eight or nine of those things, and then you know exactly which dialogue corresponds with tier one, tier two, tier three, four, five, six, then you can pinpoint, but... <laughs> hey, what in the world? Oh! Oh my gosh, that side eye, beauty looking back. What in the world? Oh, it's my birthday. Look at that nice outfit that you're wearing. See, Audie's been planning me a birthday because she's my best friend on the island. So secretly. This is cute. Ow, my eyes! Ow! Why would you aim that at my face? 
Happy birthday. Here's a birthday present from all of us. Prezi. Okay, so this is going to be a variable that I cannot even talk about. Like now, does Audi hosting a birthday party give me and her friendship points? Like, I have no clue. So again, that's why I say my variance is like plus or minus 10. Like, what does this mean? Direct your attention to the ceiling. Kaboom, check it out. Oh, give me that stick. That's a pinata. All right, what's gonna be inside the pinata, guys? Should I hit pud Pudge with the stick? Oh my gosh, how do I do it? It won't break? Excuse me? With some soft whittle the wickety thwax? Since when do you talk like that? Whack, whack, whack. Don't talk like a child, Audie. Totally not stale cupcakes like your favorite KK song. All right, cool, cool. Birthday cupcakes. Thank you, thank you. Mmm, yummy. You know, that's why they named that song Stale Cupcakes, right? Thank you, Audi. Um, uh, this is nice and all. This is in your house? Where did, where did the couch I gave you go? You sold the cute couch I gave you? And what about all those sewing kits? All right, I, I'm I'm gonna say, I'm gonna go out on a limb and just say like talking to Audi. Like I think I have one point. <laughs> Thanks. You know I was actually taken aback by that. It is my birthday. Happy birthday, me. All right. Happy birthday to me. <laughs> all right, that's cute. Uh, but again, I don't know if that counts as any kind of friendship, so... I'm just going to go to Audie's house right now, and we're going to be a friend. I need to get rid of all this stuff, though. Yeah, five-second rule, right? <laughs> Especially with the frosting that all the weird hair... The weird hair that uh, she's, like, shedding. Safety helmet. Fitness tank. What is this? Excuse me, what was this? A birthday hat? Who gave this to me? What in the world? Yuck. Who gave me? I don't... Okay, they must have slipped that in my pockets. I didn't even realize. <laughs> no, get that birthday hat out of here. Get these cupcakes out of here. We got work to do, man. I gotta get to 255. Let's go. Audie's like, hey... What's that over there? Yoink! Slip that right in. No thanks, Audie. Not appreciative of that. All right, here we go. Okay, so we got some fortune telling kits, and then remember, the magic kit is going to be the item that will net not bells or any of the um, any of the random items that they give you. So keep that in mind. Dark lily wreath. Oh, interesting. Cool. Fortune telling set, and then this is the magic kit. Okay, so magic kit, I'm gonna put on the bottom here, and we're gonna test that one for science. We're gonna see exactly what's going on with that. Ooh! Don't you meow at me, boy. I know, I know. Hi. You guys hear that? It's a loud cat. Benjamin doesn't meow like that. Does he? Okay. 
Here we go. So these are going to be regular gifts. That will be at least 70 points worth of stuff. And then I have the magic kit, which I'm going to go to Audi's right now. What if Audi was at home, like programmed to be at home at this time of day, every single day? How awesome would that be? Just knock on her door. Knock, knock. Here I am. You're not sitting down. Hey, Oreo, no. Oreo, you don't even listen to me. Hold on, I gotta get rid of a bad boy. Dude, he is bad. Okay, here we go. <laughs> All right, so uh, yeah, talk to her. I'm adding the plus one, 168, and then we're gonna give her a present for an additional, what do we call it, seven? Oreo is scratching on the couch downstairs. And that is, un that is not a nice thing to do if you're a guest in our house. You better run, dude. What a cuckoo cat. Anyway, here's the fortune telling set. Oh, sorry, I was supposed to do the other one, right? Okay, so this is fine. This is an easy, what do we call this one? Three for furniture, four for gift wrapping, three for best friends, so that's seven. So 168 plus seven is 175, right? Double check my math. All right, adios. Or should I say adios? My cat is going nuts. So now you're scratching a cardboard box. Well, that's better, you can scratch that box. This cat's losing his mind. Any of you guys have cats that go crazy? Yeah, you. Any of you guys have cats that go crazy? Cats that just go bonkers for no reason. Oreo is weird because like when he's in like his playful crazy mood, like his tail thrashes and like he like looks at his tail and like he thinks it's like someone else's tail. So he like bites it and he like chases after it and like bats at it. It's weird. Weird, man. I've never had a cat that like bit its own tail because it thinks it's like something attacking him. Weird, right? Oh gosh, he's going nuts. He's playing with himself, just running around in the basement. All right, come on, Audie, let's do this work. All right, here we go, that grind. That grind starts now. Once we give her the magic set, we can prove if she gives us bells or other things, and that is going to be whether or not uh, we'll get an extra point. And I know we're gonna miss out on three points, but it's fine. Audi, be in your room. Oh, you're right here, sweet. Oh, dang, yo. Uh, buy a toothpaste frosted cupcake? Yeah. Oh, no, I wouldn't actually do that. I'm just showing you that the mischief reaction. Oh, I needed that one. I like the mischief reaction. <laughs> oh, that's perfect. I got a plan for that face. All right, thanks. Do you need something? Yeah, let's chat. Oh, wow. Shout outs to Holly. Look at that. From Avalon. All right, I'm adding the plus one. 176. Here we go. Do you want this? Sacrificing one day to test out. This is a magic set. Now remember, this costed 980 bells, which is right underneath the benchmark. She should not give us bells or money for it. Perfect. Absolutely. Okay, so, um, how many points did that net us? Yo, that's it. That's the end of the stream. You guys can sing along too. You gotta do the yeah, yeah, yeah part. Oh, 
Oh, they whistle it? <laughs> oh my gosh. Yo, we just bust out into a, a dance party. A bubblegum KK dance party. What the heck just happened? How many points is that? You guys are distracting me, you little singers. I'm saying I'm getting four points off of that. Dang, everyone? Oh, it's up for Mac. He doesn't know the lyrics. I'm adding four. One, two, three, four. Three points? For it being a furniture item, one point for it being gift wrapped. And since she didn't exchange bells or an item, I don't get the extra three bonus points. Okay, is this the rest of the stream? Keep singing! Oh, okay. <laughs> Even, even Cube knows the lyrics. Alright, alright, we're, we're singing a new song. Do I not have disco? Oh, wow, this is the rest of the stream. <laughs> Forget science, man. A balloon! Don't even look at that balloon. Dang, you got the footsteps too. Audie's got the footsteps. Look at that. Th I'm telling you, those are the best top two songs right there. All right. As much as I love this dance party, we got science to do. So thumbs up for the dance party if you guys enjoyed that. Oh my gosh. So good. Dun, 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 dun. I mean, sometimes you just have to have a jukebox in the middle of your little town hall area in order to get them to have some pretty cool dance-offs. And then you could change the song with whatever you want, which is pretty fun, so. Bet you didn't know that. Let's go, science time. Here we go. Do 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 do. <laughs> type your favorite song in the comments right now. And not everyone all at once type in KK Disco or Bubblegum KK. Not everyone at once, okay? <laughs> oh man. You know, Hypno KK is actually really good. So that's underrated, Hypno KK, for sure. DJ KK is a good one. Yeah, that's one of my favorites. Definitely top five. KK Dirge? No way. Really? Go KK Rider? Yeah, that one. That's a Smash Bros. music. <laughs> that song originated in Smash Bros. I don't know what you're talking about. You know that town and city level? Alright, it's raining. Audie, please don't be outside. Please be in your house. 
Yeah, she loves being in her house in her house at this time of day. It makes my job way easier. Okay, so add the one for talking to her. Oh no, you don't read a book right now. Hey there, my fabulous bestie. It's so fab you're here. See, that's kind of like that's a trigger that says, "Hey, you're at least in tier five or tier six. Okay, and then that's the plus one. I don't think I give her something if she's sitting down, right? Yeah. Apparently, you guys proved that to me at the very beginning of this live stream. But you can see all the items she changed out. So all those sewing kits, they're gone. One's a fortune telling set, one's a magic kit. Please not be sitting. Thank you. Ooh, good. Perfect. Now give me bells or an item, and we'll claim our uh, seven points. Modern office chair. Oh, sweet! I actually needed an office chair. Nice! Okay, so remember, besties is three points. Furniture is three points, so that's six. And then add one for gift wrap. Seven? Yeah, yeah, seven. Seven. So that's going to be 188. Right? 188? Do, 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 do. That dance party was actually really cute. I should, uh, whenever I cut to end screen, whenever I cut to end screen at the end of my videos, I should have that music automatically playing in the background of the actual villager singing Bubblegum KK on repeat. That'd be funny. Doom, 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 doom. All right, we're almost there. 255 is not that hard. It's not that far. We're going to get eight points every single day. Someone do the math. Someone do the math. How many more days until 255 if we're at 188 right now? How many more days of traveling? Go. Mathematicians out there? Who? May 30th. Oh, we're going to be into June, man. I cannot wait. Uh, you know, I was honestly going to do June fishing today, but I thought that this would be way more fun. Oh, so about eight to nine days, nine to ten days. All right. Let's go. If Audie's at home, it makes it this much easier. I'm going to move Audie's house next to mine. Yeah. Get a new neighbor. The walk all the way over here. Yeah, thank you. I know you saw it. Oh, building, huh? What you building? Hanging terrarium. Oh, I saw a lot of these in people's houses. I was very curious. All right, well, I'd like one. Thank you. All right, thank you. Hey, it's super great to see you. What's the latest? This is me talking to you. I know what kind of books just likes, absolutely. Thank you. Okay, so that's me talking to her for one point. Thank you. And then here, take one of these fortune telling kits. I only have a couple more, so I have to make an order within the next couple days. Yeah, it's all yours. Thank you. I'll take bells or an item. Thank you. Jockey's helmet. Okay. I don't think Audie has a sp 
specific set of items that she gives. So that's interesting. All right, so now I have two presents left. You guys said that's gonna be about eight for fortune telling set, like eight or nine. So that means I'm just gonna order about five more right now. Let's see. Okay, I'll check the mail for that and we should be all set. So 189, looking good. Okay, this is good, this is good. For science, man, we are almost at that max rating. And her friendship is not going down. I'm not gonna send her any trash. <laughs> or hit her on the head with a net. Dun -dun 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 Ooh. Narina, you just got Audi too? Yeah, Audi's pretty cool. We gotta get some buzz about Audi, right? Raymond's taking all the spotlight right now. It's kind of annoying. And Raymond's not even that cool. Audi, 2020, right? Audi is the new Raymond. Agnes is better? <laughs> oh no. Agnes is the worst. I think if you were to make a tier list of worst animals, Agnes would probably be on the bottom. Just saying. <laughs> Agnes. No, there's some really ugly looking frogs in the game that are probably worse than a black pig. Why is everyone obsessed with Raymond? I don't know. I think it's because he is a, an exclusive villager now that you can't get from amiibo cards or anything like that. Just like Audi. Audi is the exact same thing. Like, Audi is the exact same rarity as uh, Raymond. And then I think it just went viral because, I don't know, someone made a tier list, the tier list got shared, and then people are just like, oh, you know, this is it. This, is, this has to be concrete proof. So it just kind of blew up out of that. Hi, are you here to hang out? Yes, I am. Let's hang out. Thanks for the point. Yoink! Do you want this? It's a fortune telling set. I'll take my seven. 197. Thank you so much. Yo, you're getting big points here once you're besties. 197. See ya! <laughs> Why does Pudge always look so sad? That's just his mouth. I don't know. I don't know why Pudge always looks so sad. Because he's been around for so long. He's been around since GameCube. And he's not made the top of a tier list anywhere. That's why he's so sad. So this is interesting. Now, uh, you reminded me, we have three more points until we're at favorite level six. And that means that you are going to get the maximum amount of dialogue, right? All the dialogue, remember, goes through a filter and a flow chart. And now when you're at tier six. Oh, what is that? Is that a mosquito? Oh, I haven't stepped foot in June yet. Oh, that's going to be exciting. Hold your excitement. Say hi to Rocco. Hold your excitement. I'll get Mosquito when we do the bug and fish video. Yikes. Every time I see that shadow in the back, in the back by the mug over there, 
It's a little trippy to look at. Like the fan blades are like spinning on top of those mugs. Looks a little weird. Almost like it's glitching out. Do, 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 do. Here we go. Give me that. Oh, yo, the bank of nook. Yeah. Yo, those nerf prices. Am I right? Those nerfed interest rates. Nice. One minus 10K? Beautiful. Love it, man. Those nerfed interest rates. <laughs> Yeah, that's a pretty, pretty bad interest rate there. But whatever. Who cares? Welcome to, uh, welcome to the real world, where, you know, sometimes you don't even get that much on your interest rates. Right? What is this? A modern office chair from Audi. It's the Audi office chair. See Mac in the back. Mac attack. Audie in her house? Audie's not in her house. Come on, girl. What the heck? I, this is the, it's been a while. Oh! You're behind your house. Hi. <laughs> Hi. I am having a total blast. Let's become the best of friends now. Yoink. I will take that one point. What should you do tonight? I don't know. Talk to me. Hi there. What do you need? Are you sad or something? What do I need? I need to give you this. Beans! Enjoy. <laughs> okay, open it now. Oh, it's another fortune telling set. How did you know? Denim overalls. Okay, taking my seven right now. Well, that's gonna be 205. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Six. Is that 205 or 20? It's 205, yeah, I'm sorry, 205. You mad at me or something? I'm all about having fun. It's a sit party. All right, adios, see ya. Thanks for knowing you. Kiki, don't even think about it. You're stuck on this island, Kiki, until I find all the wolves and you'll be the last one I kick out. It's 205. 205. Here we go. Only a couple more days. And then we're gonna do another couple extra days, don't worry. Just to overcompensate for potential errors in the invisible counting. Which four wolf amiibo are there that you have? Is Sky one of them? Sky, I don't know. Is that an old one? Sky has to be like an older Animal Crossing villager. Like, I don't know the history of any of these things. Like, if you talk to me about Pokemon, yo, I'll tell you all about Pokemon. <laughs> talk to me about Yokai Watch, I'll name every single Yokai. But Animal Crossing villagers? No, man. On any given, like, average casual Animal Crossing player, like, what? You may be interacted with. 10 villagers plus or minus in any given Animal Crossing game that you played. Really hardcore fans though, like, oh man, like, yo, you show me a picture of an animal and I'll name that guy, like, let's go. That's definitely not me. I'll name a Pokemon and a Yokai, but no, not Animal Crossing. Dun, 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 dun. Yo, Mac, get out of my yard, guy. Do not talk to me. Just having a casual stroll. Don't look at my baby. Don't look at my peach baby that needs to breathe. I gotta go let him out. And tan lines, and his new brother tan lines. We gotta go get him. This is Audie, I knew it. No, it's Pudge. Dang it, I didn't know it. Are you? Oh my gosh, Audie, I gotta pick your weeds before you're gonna move away, right? Shredder. 
Why is it that you can run through weeds? Kiki, stop. Don't talk to me. Come on, Audie. You were in your house the entire time. I had so much good luck. Look it, it's like a party in my property. Get out of here. Don't look at my gallant statue. Wow, what a waste. I'm done looking for her. It's playing hard to get today. She's like, I need some space from Abdallah. This guy's been talking to me every day. Like, what the heck? Audie, I'm gonna need some space from you after this one. Don't even give me that. Ah, oh, don't even give me that. Audie, I'm gonna need some space with you after this one. Once we do all this testing and science and stuff like that? No, man. Oh, but kind of like I need a space from <laughs> what? From fossils? I need a space from crazy red, jolly red. I need a space from hybrids. I need a space from Jacob's ladders, man. I need a space from fruit trees. I am not going to check inside stores and or the potential 10 rooms in the museum when I could easily just switch the day forward and find her at home. Thanks for the suggestion, though. <laughs> no, sorry. I'm trying to optimize this run here. I'm not playing hide and seek with Audie. If you're not in your house or in and around it, I'm going to the next day. Anybody got time for that? Ooh, Shredder. Oh, man. You, get out of here. That bear needs to go. Look, my, my flowers are growing. My flowers are... Hey, there we are. Thank you. Take, take my one point. Hey there, my fabulous bestie. Oh, dang. Okay, so look. She called me her fabulous bestie. That has to mean something, that we're obviously in tier 6 right now. Versus like regular bestie, and now I'm a fabulous bestie. This is yours. Yoink! Give my 7 points. A polo shirt. Oh man, my foot is clipping right through the ground. Yikes. Uh, add the seven. So that is going to be 13. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Beautiful. Almost there, guys. Almost there. Fabulous bestie. So cool. At 255, you get married in Animal Crossing. Totally legit. No fooling. And then when marriage season comes in June... I'm kidding. No, that's not what happens. <laughs> Although... Can you marry your villagers? Should I title that the video? Of the video when I like take all this data and like make it into bite size? Can you marry your villagers? That's a little weird, why are you asking? And no, don't say asking for a friend, you little weirdo. 
<laughs> Can you marry your villagers? Asking for a friend. <laughs> you weird. Leah, what's going on? Missed the call yesterday because of kid stuff. Maybe I'll catch uh, the next one. Keep in my subscription. Hey, welcome. I don't know what call you're talking about. I don't remember calling you, but... Which call? Like the notification of when we're streaming? Oh, so you were that out of area code uh, number that was calling me the other day? Oh, got it, got it. Yo, pump an iron right next to your picture. That real flex. Fabulous bestie. Single player hide and seek and you won. <laughs> yeah, that was the other day when I didn't look for you. Give me my point. Give me my point. Oh, the VIP chat. Oh, that. That's what we were talking about. Oh, no. You missed it? Dang. Don't worry. There's next, uh, there's next month. It'll be really fun. Single player hide and seek. It's funny. Adding the 7 is going to be 21. Cycling shirt. Wonderful. 21. Looking right into my soul. What's she doing? Get out of here. Fabulous bestie. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. All right, here we go. Wow, wow, wow. Oh, Biwa, you missed all the fun. Should I like put that in like the stream chat? I don't know. You guys let me know. I don't really want to bug you guys too much. Oh, I missed all the fun. Oh, we had a dance party. There was a singing party. All of you guys coming in late. Man. We're getting this big Audi science right now. Uh, yeah, it must be because you're brand new. It's all, it's okay. It's forgivable. H. Fenton was totally taken over. Good job. Good job, team. All right, here we go. June 5th. Oh my. June 5th. Hmm. I really want to go do... I want to make the video, the bugs and fish video for June. I do. I want to make it so bad. It took so long to make a hanging terrarium. It took so long to make the May one, you know? Did you guys like that, by the way? Give me like a little bug or a fish emote if you guys enjoyed the May video that showcased everything about bugs and fish for May for southern and northern hemispheres. Let me know in the comments. That is a big bug. I'm not about to go talk to it. You are uh Whoa, where are you? Oh no. Fine. Do you guys like that? A bug or a fish emote? Thank you. I'm growing these new types of flowers. I don't know if you guys seen these flowers before, these little yellow ones. It's a very rare breed. It um it only grows on your island when you have a, a photo frame picture of Audi right in front of her house. Just doesn't like Audi for some reason. She's annoying. Why is she annoying? She says stupid things. I like <laughs> Like what? What is a stupid thing that she says? Because that's rude. I don't talk to Audi. I only talk to Pudge. Oh, okay. Well, guess what? He's gone. Are you kidding? Yeah, he had to leave. You got rid of my friend? He's gone now. You have his did letters though, right? you get rid right? of my friend? Yeah, he's out of here. Internet, did he get rid of Pudge? We said adios to him. I came down here for a reason and you've distracted me. Oh, dang it. I can't find Audie. She's playing single player hide and seek right now, so I'm going to skip the next day. Pudge left you a, a message. He wrote you a goodbye, farewell letter. Check your mail. 
the next time you play no, this game. No, some people are telling me they did not. Well, some people like to lie. I've learned that more recently. <laughs> you can't always believe every comment you come across. Hi, Bangle. Hi, Bangle. Say your name, my Animal Crossing. Hi, Bobby. I don't know what that means, but hello. I can't find Audie. Because she left. Where'd Pudge go? He gone. Look at me in the eyes. I didn't get rid of Pudge. Look at these eyes, though. Yeah. <laughs> hey! Guys, I didn't get rid of Pudge, right? He was thinking about it. I like Pudge. He's so sad. Yeah, I know. A lot of people like Pudge because he's sad. You know why he's sad? Because he's living on this island that no one talks to him. I talked to him. So I said, hey, you know, if you want to go to a different island where people would love you, you're more than welcome to. No. Yeah. I couldn't find her. She's gone. She left. She didn't want to be your friend. You know, I was talking to her. stream trying to be your best friend. Yeah. I was talking to Audie and then she threatened to leave. Right when I was, like, becoming her best friend. Put your time back an hour and Audie will be home. Cool theory. Thank you for the super chat. I came down here for something. I don't know. I don't know either. It's your fault. You came down here because you don't have any Zoom calls. All of you guys in, like, e-schooling right now. How many of you guys are neglecting your Zoom call that you guys should be in? Because you think it's some sort of early summer break. And because the teachers aren't grading any of your stuff. Or, or because your grades don't matter anymore. You think you can skip out on Zoom calls. Huh? Hands up. You know who you are. I'm not. I'm shaming them publicly in front of 2,800 like, people. Look at this. Do it. No. Uh, All right. I added a point. All right. Here we go. Audi. Cool, Kazu. Hey. Just want to say thanks for Animal Crossing guides. They help. Would you like a fan art of your Animal Crossing character? Yeah. I would love any fan art. If you guys are good at fan art. Adam Doll Nation, tweet me. Can you get them, please? Thanks. Oreo went and chased Enjamin out of here. Adding the seven. Uh, that's gonna be 29. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Um, no, I was, uh, I was just messing with you guys. Like, that's one of, the, like, Jess's pet peeves. Like, she's a high school teacher right now, and in the world that we live in, like, it's, it's really rough because you have to... If you're still in school, she's a high school teacher. And if you're still in school, like, these teachers are, like, you know, making these plans, these lesson plans and everything like that. They're, they're actually just doing a lot of work. And then organizing these Zoom meetings so that they can teach you and stuff like that. And then she's, like, her biggest, like, pet peeve right now is, like none of her kids none of her kids are like going to these scheduled zoom meetings to learn the curriculum that the teachers are working hard to teach so that's kind of a thing it's like and it's kind of silly too like what are you doing you think this is just the free summer break like come on now grow up grow the heck up am i right i don't know what are your thoughts on it let me know in the comments and then plus when you type out your thoughts on it tell me how old you are so I know, like, hey, if you're older like me, you're like, okay, obviously, that's pretty rude of some kids. Or if you're just a young kid, you're like, I don't have to do a Zoom call. I'll play Animal Crossing all day. Mm -hmm. Let me know. I'll play Animal Crossing on the Zoom call. Let's Let be me know. honest with everybody. Oh, there you are. Next to Abel's. Got you. I spy. Alex says, my 100 student class, only seven students went to the Zoom meeting. Yeah, I believe it. Dang. That's terrible. That is terrible. Uh, ages can be anything. No, nothing's gonna happen. Only say your ages if you're older than 13. How about that? Because if you're not, 
Go become 13. <laughs> or make sure your parent is watching right next to you. How about that? Just blanket statement right there. And you're giving teacher shout outs and appreciation, did I hear that? I was giving teacher shout outs and appreciation, I always am. Right? Look at yeah. that, right? Where the heck did Audie go? Dude, Isabel just talks too much. And now I lost Audie. Forget Audie. No, this whole stream's dedicated to Audie. There's that good dog. I don't even know her name. Pink dog. Yeah, you don't even know her actual name. Penny. Can you read any of these comments about how people think about the yes. Zoom calls? Um. Oh my god, they're going too fast. Yeah, a lot of people have opinions on it. My daughter's school is giving her work to do, and she's only sick of six. I wish they would do Zoom meetings. They miss their teachers. Um, yeah, right? We oh. miss our students. My daughter is in pre-K, and we do workbooks every day. Yeah, a lot of workbooks, especially for the little friends. Blah. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay, and you need to rescue Enzo. Please go rescue Enzo. He does, from so that monster. Dala. He's... My Enderman's gonna get hurt. My Enderman's gonna get hurt. He's a precious child. That's my best friend. Triangle shades? Oh, that's pretty cool. Adding 7. 37. <laughs> Laura B. Uh, I believe education is super important. More kids should be attending their online classes. Yeah. I agree. Yeah, amen to that. Preach. It's just super... I just think it's super disrespectful. That's the thing. Like, just okay. don't do it. But then if you show up to the Zoom or online school or whatever... Get off of Animal Crossing. And, and pay attention. Phone. Get off your phone. And just sit there and listen. And wear some clothes. Don't go standing up with your underwear so I can see your stuff. Right? Oh, so correct. <laughs> All right, I'm back to read your comments because I need a break from upstairs. <sighs> mm hmm. So, what happened? Who was fighting who? I don't know. They were not fighting when I went upstairs. Uh huh. But someone's taking a nice time out down here. <laughs> what? Taking a break. Oh, okay. Break. So oh, no one is beating him up I know, right now. I know his crazy call. He's just insane. He has his crazy cuckoo okay. time. Instructor made 55 short videos for the rest of class. Only 50% of the class on average watched them. It took me three times more time to make yep. them. Yes! Yes! LNL. -L. I teach high school special education, and I make math videos and language videos and health videos, and it takes me forever and, no and nobody one watches, them. watches them. Nope. But I did it. They're there. They exist. If you want to take my math. Yeah, that's right. They're all on YouTube, too. No, they're not. They're all on YouTube, unlisted. You guys can watch Jess's uh, teaching you about health class. You don't want to watch those. <laughs> <laughs> you don't. Oh, man. You need a parent permission slip. Yeah, you to need watch a those. parent permission slip to learn about health. Look at these. Look at these wonderful flowers. You see these new breeds? You see these right here? Yeah, what These are yellow they? breeds? That's pretty cool. Why are they? They're uh, the Audi flowers. Are they weeds? They are full grown weeds. Mm -hmm. Where the heck are you? I think you? I came down here to tell you I think I need a nap. Okay, are you going to take a nap I'm today? I'm not taking a nap today. At all? No. I got work to do. Okay, I have work to do too, but I can't look at the screen anymore. Yeah, I'm almost feeling that. This is like three hours of testing this. We're at the, the very, this is the climax of it, the end. What are you doing? We're finding how Audie's gonna be our best friend. She ain't. She already is. We're like super besties. What did they call us? Like hyper besties? But then what are you, Fab besties? Then what are you doing? We're pushing the limits for science. Yeah. What the heck 
are you? A little <laughs> hider. <laughs> what? McMom face plus two. McMom face plus. What does that even mean? She says that her students take the tablets into the bathroom. Oh, that's good. That's I fine. Believe it. 100%. Yeah, yeah, here we go. I got you. Oh no! <laughs> oh, hurry, hurry. What? I'm out of here. What's wrong? Nothing's wrong. Oh, statue. Get over here. She gone. Okay, that's better. <laughs> Alright, so I'm taking my one point from talking to her. Uh, if you and me went to an amusement park, which ride would you try? Oh, cool. Uh, a roller coaster for sure. Bungee jumping's way too scary. Log ride, I don't like being wet, so let's do the roller coaster. Wrong. Uh, those are a great way for screaming away all of your stress, but I can't scream too much, it'll ruin my beautiful singing voice. It's true. Alright, I'm taking that one point, and then I got some stuff for ya. I like the log ride. Yeah? Yeah, where's the teacups at? No. That's really where it is, that's no. the answer. No, 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 no. Gung, 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 gung. Okay, see ya. Can you wake me up? Yeah. When are you done with this? Uh, I don't know. Maybe in like another 30 minutes or so. Perfect. You wake me up then. Sure, see ya. Goodbye, internet. Adding a 7. Oh. Uh, 7 plus this is going to be 45. Good county. You can come to my math class any day. Beautiful. Okay, we are... We're there. I need a couple more fortune sets, though. I'll give her the other color ones too. There we go. I gotta turn that gallant statue around. Trust me. I took all my fakes out for one more last hurrah. You guys are gonna love it. I think I'll do it maybe tomorrow or the next day. The last hurrah. The last hurrah for fake portraits. Oh. Yeah, there's more than one color. There's like it's like six colors of everything in the game. It's crazy. All right, here we go. So let's take a look. We have been doing this science for quite some time. And by now, I think you guys are experts. Hands up in the comments if you've been here since the very beginning. Hands up. Ham hands up emoji. If you guys have been here since the very beginning, you now know everything there is to know. There are some like little extra stuff that don't even matter about friendship. What it really boils down to is all of this. Talking to them, getting one point, giving them a nice item that is of a thousand or more in order to gain the extra friendship. And you're done. That's it, man. You do this X amount of times, you become best friends, boom, done, for science. It's cool, man. It's cool stuff. I'm getting eight points a day, at least. There you go, in the blue flowers next to someone's house. All right, in the blue flowers next to someone's house. Isabel, come on, stop talking. Let me go, let me go, let me go. You know what would be really cool? If Isabel said, hey, current turnip prices are so-and-so. Or, we have a so-and-so villager over here. What's Sahara doing? You know, like, what are you doing? I don't care about the time. Oh, you got a visitor in the campsite. That's good. I like that concept. A visitor. Who could it be? Watch it be, uh, ooh, we got a... We got a villager in the campsite? I heard that's like a 20% chance or something like that. That even if you have a full house, if you have a full house of villagers. Yo, in before Raymond. In before Raymond. Ugh! Ugh! Oh, man, that was the ugliest thing I've ever ever seen in my life. 
Tell me. Tell me you guys have also felt the exact same first impression when you saw that thing. Yo, hold on. Hey, hold on. Hold on. Fine, fine. Yo, you guys know Rodney? <laughs> Rodney's the worst. Alright, adding my plus one. Here we go. Hey, you're just thinking about, uh, thinking about me. Hey there, my fabulous bestie. I came for a chat. One, you're fab. Two, I mean that. Three, there is no three. Oh, isn't that cute? That's nice of you. Oh, here we go. Do you want this? Oh, do I have anything? Oh, I don't have anything to give you. Sorry. Oh, gonna... oh no, don't tease me. Negative five points. Just kidding. That's not how things work. What if it is, though? Negative five points because I did not grab my stuff. Yo, remember, we have to go and open up all these presents that Audie has given us. No, um, Rodney is the most beautiful looking animal in all of Animal Crossing. I just didn't have access to Rodney or else he would have been my first choice on making this video about him. So don't get me wrong, you guys are twisting my words. That, re that initial reaction was uh, completely out of context. I was just appalled at how such bare living space he has cramped up in that little camp tent. I was very appalled at that. Where the heck was Audie? What's my username again? Turn a price there, 89. Oh dang, trying to help at 89. Is that a good, is that a good selling price? Yo, where did Audie go? Thanks, man. So, like, you didn't include the dodo code or anything like that. How are people gonna come visit you trying to help out the community, man? Let's go. I need to see another... <laughs> Where did Audie go? She's up and teleported. Seriously. Oh! Um, yeah, I'll wait until your conversation's over. I don't want to butt in. Like, that's very rude. But you guys are also on the bridge, too, so can you move? There you go. Once you laugh, you can just, like, shift her over. <laughs> what the heck was that? <laughs> Who the heck was that? How to wave dash a character over and to get him off a bridge. Oct Octagonal. Octagonal? Uh, plus the seven uh, is going to be a one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. 253. Octagonal. Octagonal. How do you even pronounce that word? <laughs> uh, I love English. It's good. Because it's an octagon. Alright. I never have to use the word oct to describe. Something with, what, eight sides or whatever? Oh, yeah, that thing over there is very... Octagonal. Octagonal. What's that name in the uh, Harry Potter? What's her name? McGonagall? Something like that? Wow. <laughs> Larry Porter? Was that Harry Porter? Do 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 do.
Yeah, you guys know Harry Porter. That's the guy with the glasses and like the lightning bolt on his head. Watch this fish bait. <laughs> no, watch this fish bait. That's the guy with the lightning bolt on his eye and he wears the glasses. And he has like a magic or something, he does magic. Harry, right? Harry Porter. Larry Shorter? Very close. I thought I, I thought I thought it was close. All right, here we go. Audi, 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 where are you? I'm coming. Audi, this is it. This one's gonna be. Oh, what should you do? You should get out of town, doggy boy. But not yet. Do 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 do, Audi. Give me it. Harry Porker could be Harry Porker. I don't know about that. We look at these nice. Fortune sets. Oh, so cool. Out with the old and with the new, apparently. Alright, I'm taking my uh, my one right here for talking to you. Small cord cardboard boxes. Very nice. Okay, thank you. Let's talk. I'm taking my point. Poker face competition. Yup. Yup. Okay, here we go. It's super great to see you. Again. Here we go. Bing, bing, bing. I heard, so I heard you like fortune telling sets. Bethany, hey, what's up, Bethany? Huge fan. Oh, thank you. I'm glad you enjoy the content. Uh, let me add the seven really quick, and then we'll talk. Uh, seven is going to be 61. Her room is now just a junk room because of all the junk that we've been giving her. Bethany, thank you so much for enjoying the content. What content do you enjoy the most on my channel? Don't everyone say Animal Crossing New Horizons videos at the same time. <laughs> Mario Kart Tour? Alright, you better be there. You better be there, Jaden. Ask tomorrow. We're going to do it. Road to Ranked. I'm going to lose my cool like I did last week. But you know, it wasn't... I, I took solace in the fact that a lot of people during that last week's ranked mode didn't do so hot. Like, they were, like, really hyper-competitive tryhards. That's fine. It's cool to be a tryhard. I'm a tryhard. You're a tryhard. I hate the term tryhard. I hate that term. It's just a term to, like, call someone who's better than you. I don't know. Anyway, so a lot of people didn't like last week's ranked. And I still made it in my tier, which is crazy, but I don't know how I'm going to do this time around. I don't have that gold dry bones, man. I did not purchase $40 worth of rubies in order to get gold dry bones for free. I did not do that yet. Oh, today's Pudge's birthday! Well, if it's Pudge's birthday, what do you guys say? Should we skip Pudge's birthday? Should we go skip Pudge's birthday? What the heck are you? Where the heck do you live? Are you in your house? Alright, we'll skip Pudge's birthday. I don't remember which house Pudge's is. Pudge, I got you a present. I heard you like fortune sets, Pudge. Yo, Pudge. Oh, he doesn't have that many friends. Or maybe there's a an occupancy uh, deal here. I did come to celebrate your birthday. I got you something too, dude. Bethany, hey, what's going on? 
I did bring you a present. You know I did. Here we go, look. I hope you enjoy it. <laughs> wow, you wrapped it up so nice. I wonder what's inside. Ooh, wow, you got me a fortune telling set. How'd you know I really wanted one? Thank you so much. Thanks for the gift, golly. What a real great birthday. So this was the birthday thing, like when you go over to someone else's birthday and you get birthday celebration. So that's kind of cool. An untamed party animal, very nice. So the true friends is really just reaching good friend status with multiple people. Uh, Bethany, thank you again for the super chat. Um, really love your Animal Crossing videos. I just started your island about four days ago. Really hope to get Apollo on your island, but also Audie, yeah. Hey, thanks for coming. Yeah, that was the birthday song too, KK birthday. <clears throat> uh, yeah, I don't know what that is. What's my username again, but you're... Oh, that dude? It's not like a dead meme. The meme from like 20 years ago, man. But anyway, thank you for the super chat. I don't know what that, I don't know what you're asking. <laughs> Sorry. Um, where did Audi go? Hello? Audi... Audino. Audino. Enzo. Yo, Audi, I don't have time for this full island tour right now. Audi's been hanging around that gallant statue too much. I don't know. <laughs> Wonder why. It must be that book that he's holding. Seriously, Audi, where the heck are you? All right, fine. You know what? I'm not playing your games. Oh, I'm not playing your games, girl. I know, she admitted, she openly admitted to saying she's playing uh, one person hide and seek. That's rude. Uh, we don't have time for that. I like, I want to get this stuff done. Okay, here we go. <clears throat> Audi. <laughs> she totally went audios. <laughs> we need some more Audi puns. I think I've kind of beat uh, beat the Audi pun down. Enzo, Enzo, come here. Enzo, Enzo. He's making his cuckoo cuckoo cries. So we know Enjamin, right? You guys know Enzo the cat. Can you hear him? Enzo, come here, buddy. Yeah, he is not sometimes. So, you know, Enzo, I call him Enjamin. And whenever he's in his crazy mode, I call him Cuckoo-man, because he's a little cuckoo. Enzo. Oh, my gosh. And he said, he, he's, he's got a pretty good impression of saying hello. <laughs> so, Cuckoo-man comes out. And says hello to me all the time. Hello. Hello. It sounds exactly like that. And he's just nuts. I don't know why. Audie, how many more of these? I got two more of these things for you. I gotta pick all these weeds later on. Dang, man, for science. Why doesn't Leaf? Don't look at my photo on the ground. Uh, why doesn't Leaf offer to pick up all my weeds for me? Huh? Isn't that what you're about, Leaf? Leaf's the worst. Top 10 worst NPCs in Animal Crossing history, Leaf. What's up, my fabulous bestie? I hear it's Cookie's birthday. Back-to-back uh, -back birthdays? Uh, I can't afford this. Remember the 18th? of this month, it's going to be a birthday bonanza. Oh, should we celebrate Audie's birthday? Hold on. Can any of you guys confirm what uh, Audie's birthday is? I can actually confirm in game, can't I? 
by looking at the back of her little photo thing. Okay, I'm gonna take the one really quick. That's gonna be 262. Fortune telling set, yeah, 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 here we go. And then we're gonna add the seven, so it's gonna be 269. August 31st. Hmm, what was she talking about in like 18 days? Born August 31st, Virgo. Favorite saying is, be the kind of person your future self won't regret having been. Wow. Words of wisdom. See, that's why you're the best, Dottie. Good job. 269? I don't know. For science, how many more times do you think to get to max 255? I mean, R plus minus... Our variances were right around an approximate 10. So we're already above that. I think I could do one more for science, but have as of right now, there's really no point to maxing out friendship. I have not seen anything. So again, in order to be, um, in order to be even more scientific about this, we need like a whole bunch more people to max out friendship and then just see if they notice anything different but i'm under the impression there's nothing you get nothing for maxing out friendship at 255. samantha if you're lost about our number then you got to watch the stream from the beginning it's like uh it's like waking up late to a zoom call and your teacher's already at the end of the lesson <laughs> wow wow no um it's based off of trust me how about this wait until i put out the video about all the actual scientific findings about everything that we learned within the last three and a half hours and then you can watch that how about that good good getting a little restless over here science man i only have a, a certain heart stamina for science right I don't like sounding like a broken record. Can you tell? <laughs> All right, Audie, this one's going to be the last one. We're just going to go to like 75, 77, 277. That's it. And I think it's safe to say that there's really nothing else that happens with Audie. Yeah, beautiful. Stay home. Look at this. These wonderful flowers we're growing here. They're so tall. New breed of flowers, man. You've never even seen it. Enzo. Adding one, 270. No way. I was totally just thinking, I wish I could talk to Abdallah right now. You know, what if that's a specific dialogue? It's got to be a specific dialogue for tier six. Absolutely it is, but... Maybe it's for something else. Chat with me. Enzo. Okay, Cookie, you don't really care about that. Enzo, come here, buddy. Oh, sorry. Um, beach Volleyball Pro? Oh, dang. Yeah, absolutely. Let's go. I didn't know you liked Beach Volleyball. Better watch. You got a spin serve? Dang. And see, this is why me and Audie are like peanut butter and jelly time. Yo, I wish I could do a spin serve. I'd do a floater. Here we go. Oh, the last one. Cool. Thank you. 77. 
All right, what is it, Foxtrot? So again, remember, we said at the very beginning, I probably said it like 20 times, these are approximations, but we found benchmarks within the approximations. It's really hard to keep track of invisible numbers. So this is just based off of what we know. And if you made a variance, there is a 22 point variance right now from 255. And I think that's more than enough of variance of what we maybe have forgotten to add potentially in this. So I think for science, it's gonna be case closed. I don't think she's gonna say anything else. We're not gonna get anything. I think the only thing I have left to do right now is open up all the mail from Audie. What do you think? So like have a little celebration. Let's, let's read all of Audie's fan mail. Let's see what items Audie gives to us. And I'm definitely gonna take my photo back home too. We're gonna put that on the wall. I gotta get this fauna photo back. Borrowed that thing hard. <clears throat> fauna. Ba -da -dum, dum dum Your fiance and, and and you are fangirling that you responded to your comment. You're the best. Oh, thank you. Thanks. <laughs> you guys should become a member. Don't just drop a super chat like that. Come on now. <laughs> the gift that keeps on giving, am I right? No, I'm kidding. Thank you so much for the super chat. No needed at all. You guys did not have to do that. Uh, DIY. All right, so here we go. I'm gonna put this Audi on my wall. Wicktoo, classic library wall, cool. We'll take this, we'll take this. And then I'm gonna dump honeycomb wall, cool, cool. And then I'm gonna dump all this stuff. So it looks like Audi just gave us random stuff. There's no, I don't think there's a theme of what she's giving. She's just giving randomness and multiples of the Rambo random stuff too. So that's kind of weird. Uh, denim overalls I got at least twice. Modern office chair, what does that look like? It kind of actually looks like my chair right now. Oh, that's so creepy. That's super creepy. And it's blue too. The chair that I'm in right now is absolutely blue. Weird. Yeah. There's an antique chair. <laughs> so, oh, that's Imperial. That's so weird. Wow, that's so weird. How did she know? Right? Gimme that guy. All right, um, we're going to Imperial. See, there we go. Samantha, you didn't have to, but welcome. <laughs> I always say that. I'm like, like if you're if you're gonna drop a super chat, like just put it towards membership. You get access to like the emoji, the community board. It's just better than a one-time thing. So welcome to it, everyone. Welcome Samantha and your fiance. I don't know your fiance's name, but hello, welcome. Super cool. All right, so we got Audie's photo. I'm gonna put it on the wall here. Huh? All right, beautiful, beautiful. We're gonna go over here. We're gonna do this. Do, 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 do. Give me this, give me this, give me this. Should I put it over here, the top corner, so no one can see it? Oh, right here. I can't even see where I'm seeing it. Uh, on the bottom, put it like right here. No, right here is fine, look. You scoot over and you go here. Done. That is it. That is the Audi photo. We have earned it within about, you know, I would say, I would honestly say within two and a half hours. We had a dance party we wasted time with. We went to a couple birthday parties. I think that in about two and a half hours of doing everything that I did over here, you can get up to 255. You honestly don't even need 255. You can do it in like an hour. Because I don't even remember the timestamp of when we did that. Anyway, so here we are. We're gonna go read some fan mail from Audie. Where's Jess to give me the reenacting voice, right? No, but she doesn't like Audie, so she'll give her like a snarky voice. I think she's jealous. <laughs> All right, here we go. Shred. All right, let's go. Audie time. And then we're gonna take a note of what items Audie gives us. I don't need these bells anymore. Or all this gold wrapping paper. 
I went gung ho on wrapping paper today. I don't know if you guys can tell. All right, so from the beginning of our Audi relationship here, let's take a look. Oh, dang, Jess, Jess bought me something? Oh, I don't even check my mail, just like in real life. Just like in real life, I'm so bad. Oh, here's Audi's poster. I was looking for this thing. I said I can't for the life of me find Audi's poster. Unbelievable. That's where that went. Anyway, uh, where was I? Where was I? We we're looking at Audi. Aud Audino. She really only gave me one, two, three, four, five, five things? That's it? Come on. All right, this is the first thing. To my BFF. It's, you know, really, really hard sometimes to tell someone how you feel face to face, I mean. So I decided to put my feelings in a letter. Okay, here, you go. here goes. I'm happy you're my friend. Oh, that's cute. Throw away. <laughs> Crumple it up. All right, here we go. Oh my gosh, check this outfit. I saw and thought that would look fab on Abdallah, so I bought it for you because everyone should have a fashion consultant. Uh, watch it be like another tea that you gave me already. Raincoat. I mean, it is raining and it's red, I, I guess. Mm, I don't know about that, Audi. Here we go. Next. The umbrella I thought I lost. Totes in my house all of a sudden. Like, it must have ran off and partied while I went and bought a new one and showed, and then showed back up. Now I'm giving it to you. Enjoy the umbrella. <laughs> Do you guys like these letters? Give me like a smiley face in the comments if you guys like reading all the little letters that you get. White shiny bows parasol. Okay, this is totally not my style, Audi. You're definitely not a fashion consultant. All right, next. Audi, here we go, from Audi. You know what I love about glasses? How much they change your face. Wait, that came out wrong. I just think it would be cool if you looked like a totally different person. What I mean is, I give up. Can I start over? <laughs> That's rude. How dare you. Ooh. Ding. You gave me glasses now? Oval glasses? At least I could pronounce that one. Weird. Octagonal? Octagonal? Ugh. Anyway. Uh, then Audi gives me this one. This is one of my favorite tops of all time. It's bold, it's colorful, it's fashion gold. Just imagining you in it has made me squeaking with delight. So much so I gave myself a headache, Abdallah. Ah! Okay. What is, what is this now? Audi, come on. A starry tank. Well, that's better than this raincoat. Whoa! <laughs> no. Not my style, Audi. And that was it. Oh, that's a little sad. That is a little sad. Well, Pudge is over here saying thanks for coming to my birthday party. That's nice. Yeah, it was a blast. There we go. Thank you. Yeah, thanks, buddy. From Pudge. A jumper work suit? Excuse me? That's the birthday... Thank you? Ew. Ew. Get out of here. Where's my design? Where is it? Here we go. Get out of here with that. I hate these glasses too. I need to take all of this off, like right now. Get out of here. Oh, my underwear. Don't look. <laughs> what is this? The gallant statue over here? Get out of here. Avert your eyes. Hide behind the money tree. There we go. That's a little better. Take these shades off. Thanks. All right. Cool. Okay. So that was it. It was a little, a little sad that. Even if we maxed out their friendship, there wasn't anything programmed in the game that said, hey, you know, like, you're my bestest friend of all time, like, like some sort of automatic generic letter that would send out, you know, by whatever person and whatever personality type there are. I, I would really have liked that. Like, once you hit max, 255, that would have been really cool. And I don't think Audi gave me a, a letter whenever we got her picture. So there's that as well. So that that's kind of sad. Here's Audie's poster. No wonder I couldn't look it up because I didn't open it out of Nook Shopping. Or maybe I did. I don't know. It was absolutely fun though. We we totally figured some stuff out. 
Uh, I'm going to do this. We're gonna hang on the wall. That's a perfect spot. Oh, that's lame. I mean, I guess. The poster's better. I thought it'd be a different pose. Like, every single villager has two different poses. But no, that's just copy-paste. Okay, I guess. I guess. I guess that's fine. That's the poster you get from Harv's Island. And then that's the framed portrait. Well, the framed portrait's interesting because you can look on the back of it and you can read their little slogan, their little motto. And you can know what kind of uh, zodiac they are, right? So that's kind of great. Wow. That's it. Guys, thanks so much for watching. We had a very awesome science-filled day today. And if you guys watched the video from the beginning, you know exactly what we went through in order to get all this stuff. Wow, that was awesome. So, man. Okay. So I would say maybe in about an hour. Honestly, in order to, if you really wanted to, you know, skip through, you know, play custom and just get these portraits and just grind them out, Honestly, about an hour in order to get to 150. Yeah, I would say so. All right, guys. Thanks so much for watching. It's pretty fun. I, I thought it was pretty great. We ha now have a best friend on our island, and I've never had that before. I don't know, maybe in, like, the old Animal Crossing games, like, on GameCube. I really like Bob. And I think I was, like, super best friends with, like, Chief and Wild World, for sure. I would send him letters every single day. So, anyway, there's it. There's a little bit of science for you. Thanks so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed the live stream today. Shout out to the 11 new members that came on board. Thank you. And all of you guys that uh, dropped off some super chats. And all of you guys that have subscribed. Thanks for being here. Tomorrow, I think I'm going to... I don't know. I'll work on the video today of, like, actually fine-tuning all the information and making it into a nice deliverable chunklet that you guys can watch. So, yeah, look forward to that either tomorrow or the next day. But I had a fun time today. You guys are a really chill audience. Thanks for coming. I hope that you guys are all subscribed. Subscribing is really easy. It takes only a quick second to do so. And there's tons of other Animal Crossing content on my channel. So, please, definitely take a look at it. That's it. I don't have the kids singing KK Bubblegum in the background yet. But we just have this eerie silence. Thanks so much for being here. Thanks for everything. Uh, come on board as a member, right? We're almost at 1,000 members. How insane is that, right? Oh, my gosh. I never thought we'd actually hit that. But your generosity during these hard times is super appreciated. So thank you. Um, all I ask is that you guys subscribe and enjoy the content. That's all I ask. Thanks for coming. Have a great rest of your day. Enjoy your Monday. And we'll see you tomorrow for some Mario Kart Tour action in case you guys like that stuff. And uh, even more Animal Crossing within the week. So see ya. Adios.